Sorry about that. Uh... Sorry about your arm. Oh no. That was that was me just sort of pissing and moaning. Not really uh didn't wasn't meaning that one very seriously. Um Yeah, HO is rad. This place was great and then like a handful of assholes got in, like, on a turn year, and then it's just been downhill since. Like, they keep making horrible decisions, and they wonder why things have gone bad. They took away all of our... It, they tore all of the trees out of the neighborhood, except for two people who were like, no, you're not taking my fucking trees. It's the whole reason why I bought this house. And since then, we've had drainage, drainage issues, lawn issues, uh, wildlife issues, and noise issues. And we had to spend a bunch of money to repave the roads a darker color because uh, we had a lighter asphalt. Because now there was no shade anywhere. So much light was bouncing up that people were like having to wear sunglasses to drive around. It was bad. Like, our place is... Like, <laughs> And the problem is our home values keep going up. I know that's really stupid of me to say my our problems are that. For this, that's it, a great thing. It is a blessing. But for this specific argument, the HOA uh, basically have taken credit for like a huge hike, when in actuality it was um, Margaritaville being built next door. And now we're like right next to where all the happening stuff is. All right, that's my rant. I don't normally turn on colorblind mode. As most of you know, I am. I had to turn it on for San Andreas. Nine times out of ten, I don't need it. However, if I notice there are things that I have trouble with, I will turn it on. But for now, I'm good. fuck with any of this oh and i think the reason why it crashed is because of a graphics update it basically did like a graphics card update sort of thing because i was like all right well seeing as how this happened let me check the g-force and it's like nope your shaders are up to date i think it's straight up updated the driver which would reset everything i visualizer no all of this looks good by the way, I like this. Appreciate a menu that takes care of this stuff immediately. Uh, yeah, just accept that. Oh, fuck. It just says here I owe them my kidneys now. Oh, man. My Harry Potter fan club and my Warner Brother Games account. Ah, uh, if only I had... I don't think I have the passwords for those on me. Aw, oh, dang. I will claim that. Ooh. New mounts are exact. Okay. Well, that's cool. Because I definitely wanted to play this one as an evil boy. Hardware benchmark and evaluation completed completing recommended graphic statements and applied. Press right click to view slash change. No. Alright. Alright, if you think we're good, we're good. However, if we start dropping streams and frames and whatnot, we'll turn everything off. I think we've gotten to the edge of the uh, internet issue. I think we were just... Um, I like to turn this all the way up. Now, barely visible. That's about right here for me, what I got going on. I think it was just we had too much internet stuff going on in the room. Like, because I've got this. I've got a few windows open so that I can observe things. I got my phone going so that I can read the chat, essentially. Ooh. Well, not read it, but interact with it. 
Preliminary supplies have been collected for you. Okay. 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 Okay, cool. So that's one of the things. I knew that there was a Professor Weasley, and I have been like, it's like I don't, I haven't read the books. Has that always been a thing? Was the Weasleys? I hear that the customization in this game is not the best. All right, let me someone who's evil and up to no good. Great, now it's gonna look like I'm racist no matter what I pick. Gotta go white guy. Kinda like, kinda leaning towards this fella. Nah, he looks a little too young. I'm looking for someone who's like, yeah, this dude's doing evil. him. Oh, okay. No, no. We can't modify him. Is this... Okay. It just takes a minute. I was like, am I actually doing anything? Okay. Hard shift. Also, that's not the guy in the picture. Getting to understand what they mean, because these are pretty much just the same phases of the people from the last one. So that about this bone structure, though, makes me think. Yeah. Evil wizard. Oh. Yeah, all right. <laughs> no. Hello, smashing darling. <laughs> Am I 15 or 35? You tell me. No. Fucking Harry Styles looking ass. Fucking Final Fantasy character looking ass. <laughs> Did you imagine this guy in your school? Hello. Mr. Moss, appreciate the like as always. How are you this fine evening? God. The idea of someone walking around Hogwarts with that haircut, though. Good representation. In the 1800s! <laughs> Alright, for serious now. Uh. Yep, this guy. Oh, fucking. Can I scar him up? Fuck. Yes. Scar him up. Of course, I'm thinking quintessential eye scar. I like that. Oh, but that is also good. How complex is this complexion? <laughs> little, little bit of lag. Okay, there we go. does not want to go from one side of the spectrum to the other that quickly. Oh, 
Oh. I thought it was a gradient scale. What a horrible way to... What a, okay. Oh, that's a little too pretty, boy. I liked a little bit of the freckles. I don't know. All those... Yeah. Hmm. God, there it is. You just looked me in the eye there. God, I mean, when you're doing evil, those big, beautiful blues, huh? But also, I forgot crazy colors. Yeah, he's got a solid black. Yeah. yeah, that's the one. No eyebrows to speak of. Thicker, thick old caterpillar babies. Yeah. Uh huh. Oh, I get I get two whole voices. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Ah, oh, British. That was quite something. <laughs> Not two thin voices, it's male or female voice. But be oh yes, of course. They thought they were being transphobic, so they absolutely A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Now I hear that if you adjust the pitch on this, it does get fucky. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. Oh, you can hear it. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. That is so tinny. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. How did that get past the... That was quite something. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. No, I have to do it. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. That was quite something. The problem is, I love this voice. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. But the tinniness on that... I am. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Do I do it and then hope they patch it eventually? That was quite something. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. That was quite something. And also, only I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. To there we go. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. Whoa, whoa, that was good. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. A few cobwebs and some dust. That was quite something. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Like, some of them aren't bad. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. Yeah, the ending part of that is not bad. I'm just going to stick with this. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. Lord Evilo. No. Not Salazar. <laughs> um. Uh. Hero. Protagonist. <laughs> Yeah, I like that.
Hyro Protagonist. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. Almost? It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well, I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me before the time begins. Hello? Oh. Are you looking for us? <laughs> Eliazar! George! Glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Why? Though I confess I may have miscalculated <laughs> slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theater goers in the West End. <laughs> it's been much too long. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak here, Eliazar. Why? Um, of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea! As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. So... Where are they then? They were... Okay, they're in luck. Okay. I'm gonna assume uh, that that was not a muggle. Support key. I do love that the dude's just wailing it on that invisible horse. Glad I caught you before you left for Scotland. <laughs> just barely. <laughs> and who is your traveling companion? Hero protagonist. Student. New. Yes, sir. I'm starting school as a fifth year. How extraordinary. It is indeed. None of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to Hogwarts so late. Nor have I. Of course, as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now, the headmaster asked if I could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins. Well, you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional like teacher, he's also a voices. remarkably like intuitive and was... gifted wizard. Everyone was Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the COVID. reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> Have you seen this? Oh, I like that. I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And... It was your wife, Eliazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died. Oh, okay. Like, wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I... received this. It was the last thing the she codex. sent me, Eliazar. It came to me via her owl. But with no correspondence, I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. Oh, I can solve that. It looks like goblin metal. Dude, don't That's be racist. Simple. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Merlin's beard. Uh, how did you wait? We did. That was good. Hang on. 
kill him. Oh, because he's seen a man die. That's good. Accio the key. Give me your heart. Okay. I forgot, once you got really powerful, you can just say Accio and think about it. You don't have to actually say Accio and think. Are you alright? You're hurt. Perhaps a bit. Take this. Oh. It's Wigan World oh. Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. Can I just stash it? And... What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he... I did. I can. What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? So... Oh, oh yeah, dragons. Where are we? I'm not sure. Ooh, good perspective. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. Oh, I thought he... I thought he... apparated. I'm feeling better, sir. If you'd like to look around a bit. I would. But stay close. We've no idea who created this port key. Or why. Was it not your wife? Ooh, get that wand out. Ah, so it's Elden Ring. You didn't you, you could have just told me it was Elden Ring. How far did that port key take us? Farther from London than the carriage traveled. We're somewhere in the Scottish Highlands. Sir, those ruins. Do you think... The port key was meant to lead us there. I do. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe hey, that to, she... like, let me know anything about George what the fuck is going on. in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me... I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. Oh, wow. The, even with the beams, I'm like, this is so Elden Ring. The path to Hogwarts. Mind your step. How about I jump around you, stupid <clears throat> idiot? Where do you suppose your wife got the port key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long-forgotten form of ancient magic. That I have, probably. Yes. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Me? I have said powers. Hogwarts oh, Castle the was light, built buddy. by, and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into no, possession of the port up. key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, oh, there's the path down below. This way. I mean, I was already but sir, that why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Oh, well, Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Me. Me. I wield it. The power is mine. Come on, let me shoot the glass. Is that ice? No. It's not it's cold enough ice. here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. 
Dude, Focus if a guy who just center. recently learned how to do this is able to basic cast his way through this, then, like, honestly, who is this stopping? Excellent! And you're gonna be like, oh, muggles, duh, idiot. Uh, if a muggle was walking through the Scottish Highlands and found a block of ice like that. Oh, cool. Zap zoop. I'm helping. That was a bit rougher than I'd expected. Your one works improving with every cast. Thank you, sir. Oh, hold on, I can do that. I'll break it. Oh, come on. Ah, up there. I mean, we could have just. I love doing this. I feel like that, uh, I knew it. 64 to blooms. The scene where, uh, Sirius dies when everyone's just like, shoot, 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 back and forth. We're close now. It's just ahead. Come on, do the scene. You know what I'm talking about. The scene from the credits. Do the thing. Steady yourself! I'm steady. Reparo! Okay, dude. How fucking powerful are you that you can repair out that? Almost there! Well, hold on. It's like, you're not supposed to shoot anybody right now. I'm like, I want to go down there. I'm sure he's about to say something that I'll be able to walk around. Is this helping? Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they value their privacy. The power. Porky led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around at anything that seems out of place. Yeah, well, definitely that fucking giant wall. You're not actually allowing me to be free. Oh, no. Okay, you are. Professor, it's a mural of some kind. Hmm. Perhaps our host was a noted seer. Interesting. So you're presumably just gonna huddle around this thing while I do the actual work? I'm done with that. Thank you. What are you? What are you? Well, this has got to be some sort of Easter egg. What? I was trying to see if there was a photo mode. Well, there's got to be clearly two characters. Go down there, your vagina. 
you vagine. Professor, this statue is this, no this may have house? been his home. Wait, this dude put up statues of himself in his house? Bitchin'. Power move, and I dig it. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? Well... What's this? Professor Fig! How odd. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again. Like the glow on the port key container. Well. So I know it looks visually glitchy. Uh, that is what? just In Merlin's name? part of it, apparently. Godric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. Apparently there is a good amount of... Uh, visual hiccups here and there, so that's to be expected. Hello? Is this Gringotts? <clears throat> Is it Warwick Davis? It can't be. Uh, just a moment. <laughs> Ooh. <clears throat> uh, what are we having here? <clears throat> God, I love how long they're on. Welcome are to, to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number 12, I presume. <clears throat> Precisely. The key. Hmm? Your wife's portkey. Oh, yes, of course. This way, then. Stay close. So is this like... After you. Are they not as well known yet? Oh, so you told me to stay close and then I gotta get on the death train first. Fuck you, dude. You're supposed to be my caretaker. Keep your hands inside the cart if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> I kind of wish to lose them. Oh, yes. Not a cutscene, but a real part of it. How many votes are there? How oh many my votes? god. In fact, You'll we'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Gringotts? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. And which, God, you I love the train. A breath. A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower lockers that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly the after the Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle in. We've quite a distance to go. Cool. It's got a little hat. He's got like a gun. Vault number 12. Vault 12. 
momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. What do they know that we don't? <laughs> Professor, hmm? the armband that guard was wearing was glowing. Like the glow you saw on the porky container. No, darker. I saw that same glow on the dragon's collar. Yeah, what was that? We were just wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Well, I mean, we're here. In a world with... I mean, in a place with so many vault numbers. To go to vault number 12. Here we are. How hunched over when he is. When was the last time this vault was accessed? A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 until today. Also, we wouldn't have known to go into Vault 12 had you not said Vault 12. The thing! Vault 12. Thank you for your help. Give him a little something, something. Throw him some shackles. Come on. Don't be a piece of crap. Tip him. Tip the man. Hey, here you go. For your what family. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir. I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait! Mr. Black? I mean, Professor, there's clearly a shimmer on the wall. was certainly unexpected. There's a shimmer on the wall. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm. Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. Boom. Boom. Revelio. There, I saw something. Move a bit closer and try again. I mean, I kind of also wanted to check for treasure. Okay. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to... I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Open. Well, you're definitely... Lumos! The person who has this magic. This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Revelio, Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. All right. Are you sure we're... I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Um... This is good. Lumos. What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Hey, what's going on Are with this guy over right? here? Yes, sir, I'm fine. Looks like this guy's trapped on the you other side. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? Is... What statue? 
I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. Appreciate the raid, everybody. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait, when you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm, perhaps you should cast Lumos. I, I will. Whee! I like that you have to like learn it. That's fun. Ooh, didn't mean to hit that. Acquire the wand lighting charm Lumos, which is automatically been on the other side of your spell slot. Okay. Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Revelio Indidio. This uh, looks less good. Look out! Protego! Accio! Dispecto! Levioso! Deposo! Deposo! I love that I'm just sort of like doing some damage and then he's like, I'll finish him. This potato is pretty cool. Bitch. Want that chest over there? Oh, I see. I'm I'm supposed to got it. I'm supposed to be using Zotago, not actually defeating these people. It's like I've, I've clearly got it. I, I want this chest, actually. Come on. Lumos. Professor! Professor Fig! Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Revelio. Lumos. Where am I supposed to go? What's happening? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Revelio. I see it. Lumos. How many of these chests do you think are down here? Before I head that way, I'm gonna just keep on. Revelio. Lumos. Just to see what I have over this way. Revelio. Lumos. Oh. Revelio. Nope. Lumos. One of those infinite hallway things. Revelio. Lumos. Ah, that's where they're leading me. That glow again. Revelio. Lumos. So Revelio appears to last for a minute. Cool beans. I will direct the magic. Okay. Rebellion. I suppose I'm on my own this time. You are aware. But that means I'm gonna have to fight all of these fools, right? I seem to have no choice. I'm gonna to have to fight my way out of here.
Defending. And that wasn't nearly as bad. Holding Q during protector to send enemies with super by counterattack. Send enemies take prone. Oh, okay. I thought I was in a loading screen, but of course. Lumos. I gotta Rebellion. Lumos it up. Lumos. Is this the same room? Revelio. Lumos. Here it is again. Revelio. Lumos. This is it. This is part of it. Like the big do this. Is it, did big know this was gonna happen? Revelio. Watch this be like a back way into uh So just a mirror on this side that doesn't work. Ooh, that was cool. Yeah, let's do it. <gasps> Lumos. Revelio. Lumos. Revelio. Yeah, hey, monies. I'm the real goblin in this game. Uh, whatever that is, I also want it. I also claim dibs to whatever's on that counter, but first, I, I gotta claim dibs on these chests. <laughs> What are you? Ooh. Is it unicorn blood? Is that some, that's memories. It's some one of those memories. Uh, there you are. How did you? What is I'm this? I'm hero protagonist, baby. I don't know. But I found this floating above that basin. It's a memory. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. Oh, my friend. My friend Greg I wonder. So proud of me right now. What if it was like unicorn blood or something like that? It's super, super rare. Follow my lead. It's just Dumbledore straight. Fucking a guy.
love that he made it overgrown. All is in place. The portkey is well hidden. Perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are oh, entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes, and if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge. Who is that? And the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. That's what you're seeing. The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Hmm. Astonishing. I have no can idea where I, I would have heard him from. Magic. Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. What's the ancient magic? The magic that Miriam had always believed existed, but could never. Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been and dormant Hogwarts for is centuries. Like a vault for and this. You, it seems it's going to be a great year. Are the key to understanding why we were. It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in there. Oh, he's powerful. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's vault. Dude, and you got skulls in your pauldrons. You're not a good guy. No need I want for them. that. Just. Give me whatever it is you found here, and we can let bygones be bygones. What bygones, you piece of shit? Kill him. <laughs> uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I, I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. I'm so scared. Sir, I, I must I insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have it. So I'm guessing he has his ancient magic. I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. <laughs> Come on, let me kill the Gabo. <laughs> the Destroyer? was that you old man you almost got us killed are you all right fine sir i've never seen so powerful a goblin he seemed wholly unaffected by my magic is that Where not normal? are we hogwarts <laughs> it can't be it seems those who set up the pensive the locket and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to.
Am I gonna bump into Aragorn? No, beans. No, Aragorn would not be around. This is, this is, <laughs> was like, it's Hagrid's bird. It's Hagrid's bird. A spider, not bird. I'm looking at it. Bird. House. This is good. This is real good, everybody. It's nice to have a game again that I'm, you know, interested in playing. Loading screen. Yep, these are those visual hiccups that I've heard oh, a lot good. about. We haven't missed the sorting ceremony. I'm no expert, but that seems more appropriate. Now, I need to study this locket as soon as I can, but first I must contact the Ministry. They need to know what happened to George and be warned of Ranrock. For the moment, I ask that you keep all that's happened this evening between you and me. Of course, sir. Thank you. Ready for the sorting ceremony? Slytherin! Slytherin! I mean, just immediately start like yelling at him. Who is that handsome young devil? Oh, devil. <laughs> Phineas Nigellus Black. Prepare yourself to meet the headmaster. Fig, nice of you to join us. I love that they're the just throwing in all these famous family names. There, there it is. Complications. Complications? It seems the goblin problem Enough. has... Enough. Goblins. I've no time for rumors, Fig. And I'm rapidly losing whatever patience I had left. If you're lucky, we might still be able to get you sorted this evening. <clears throat> I'll be in touch. Hey, dude. Like, it's, it's Harry Potter. Like, just reach into my memories and... Uh... Oh, it's Harry Potter. It... Professor Weasley, we've one more to be sorted. Welcome. You're just in time. Have a seat. Oh God. Oh God, no. Oh God, no, no. 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 Slytherin. In Ravenclaw, maybe. Ah, yes. A bit older than the others, aren't you? You come here with preferences and preconceptions. Certain expectations. You do this for everybody? I want to do both. I'm looking forward to meeting my professors and learning all I can at Hogwarts. Indeed. So that's probably Hogwarts has much to offer right a dedicated student. And what you learn in class will prepare you for challenges outside the classroom as well. Hmm. I wonder... Pride. Arrogance. Mm. self -love. I detect something in you. A certain sense of... Hmm. What is it? Superiority. Is it ambition? I may seem single-minded, but it is important to go after what you want from life. Hmm, interesting. You've recently learned that you possess a rare ability. I detect a growing sense of ambition. 
an eagerness for power. Perhaps you belong in Slytherin. <laughs> oh, you get fuck off. Back in my day, there was a test at the beginning, and your answers gave you what it was. You don't get to... I mean, that was the easiest thing in the world to pick. I can't wait to explore. I mean, I don't think those really help, but if I were to say anything, explore would be Hufflepuff and Gryffindor, and then learn would be Slytherin and that, and from the other ones. I mean. Sorting out will take your choice into account when sorting into your house. Ah. Hunting, ambition, and a hunger for power. The sword who makes an entrance. That's funny. You belong in Slytherin! Stop fucking doing that! I'm gonna turn things down oh, a bit. Oh, and one more thing. Due to the unfortunate injury on the pitch in last spring's final, this year's Quidditch season has been cancelled. I love that that was them Enough. clearly like we couldn't it's get It's not as though I've banned flying altogether, but don't tempt me. You are here to focus on your academic futures. I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. I said, I'm sure you will have plenty to do before classes begin tomorrow. Quite an entrance. It's lovely to meet I you. I will kill your children. Um, Professor Weasley, would you be so kind as to show our new student to their common room? I shall see to it, sir. As I was saying, I'm Professor Weasley. Pleased to meet you. Nice to meet you as well, Professor. Like, this is perfect. As deputy headmistress, it is my distinct honor to show you to your common room. Right this way. Are you, just, you guys just gonna leave the, the sorting hat out? It's quite uncommon for a student to begin as a fifth year. It may be a bit of a challenge, but one I'm sure you're up for. I can be quite resourceful. I suspected as much. This is the entrance to the Slytherin common room. In order to enter, one must simply speak the correct password. Aspiration. Very well. Aspiration. That's fucking cool. Well done. Now, go on in and get some sleep. You have a big day ahead of you tomorrow. I shall be back in the morning to collect you for your first class. Oh, fuck, class. is it first year? I'm uh, sorry, Thank fifth you, year. Thank you, Professor Weasley. Room, You're too. welcome. I hope you enjoy your first night at Hogwarts. Sleep well. So first playthrough will be a bad boy Slytherin evil man. And then uh, second time around will be Ravenclaw good guy. Because those are those are the common rooms I want to see. Looks like everyone's gone. Better head to the common room. Yeah. See, it's all well and good now. Potato. Okay. Revelio. I mean, luckily it's on school ground, so I can do this. Come on. Start giving me the collectibles and the side quests. I know they're here. I love this. Oh, prop, let me look through your shit. Have we? Revelio. Right, I'll, I'll come back later to all this. No, I must. 
No? Does it go around? Yeah, I bet it does. Papa Slytherin? Alright, got it. I need fresh fruit being out for me constantly. <gasps> uh, Chess mate, chess checkmate. But to be fair, <gasps> I, I thought it was gonna interact with that portrait, not eat yet another apple. You know how villains are, just constantly have apples out to eat. Big old bowls of fruit. <laughs> I love how grand this. Makes sense. I suppose some introductions are in order. Let me spin the globe real fast. How would I possibly know who those people are to introduce myself? Revelio. Did you see the way they just waltzed in at the end of the sorting ceremony last night? Can't imagine starting this this Well, as if it's my. Freaking Sebastian. Can I help you? Oh, you're the new fifth year. I'm Sebastian Sallow. Welcome to Slytherin. Thank you. <laughs> Not Sorry, everyone has a had ministry like a escort handshake. to school. My bad. He was a friend of Professor Figgs who merely joined us for the ride. Still, impressive. Dreadful way to go, poor fellow. Glad you and Fig are all right. It was dreadful, certainly, but quite an experience nonetheless. Interesting perspective. How did you and Fig manage to escape? Magic, it's baby. all still a bit of a blur, to be honest. Didn't mean to press. You just get yourself settled. We can talk more later. I will be a key in NPC later. What book were you reading? A spell book I picked up. Has a few interesting How things, but not exactly what I was looking for. I'm sure you'll find out soon enough, but not every spell you may need can be found in our assigned textbooks. Are you saying some spells aren't taught at Hogwarts? The cool Which one? ones? Seems I may have met a kindred spirit. <laughs> that is a conversation for another time. It was good meeting you. Good luck today. If you do that, you'll lose. Trust me. Ugh, not going to move there, are you? Here, watch this. 
Don't say I didn't warn you. Checkmate. Told you. I'm gonna fuck this woman. You should have listened to me. Holy shit. You oh, got a badass well, star. You wanna you fuck some You're the yes. new Slytherin. Yes, the I one do. who barged in with Professor Fig last night. Interesting Barged tactic in. on your first day. He opened the Taking door sheepishly the like a coward. Fixtures. And I hid behind the door. I'm a Melda, by the way. Shame I wasn't with you and Fig. I could have lured that dragon away. My skills on a broom are legendary. I can't wait to find out. Perhaps Professor Fig's friend would have survived if we'd had your help. Precisely. Perhaps one of these days That's I'll show you a I thing meant. or two about flying. Are you under the I water? I more than Kagawa ever could. Speaking of which, I'd like to get in some time on my broom before classes. Hold on. Okay. Do you, fly Do you have a lot of time to fly during school? I make the time. There's nothing like swerving through the spires of the castle and around the Quidditch pitch to clear the mind. Are you a keen wizard chess fan? You knew that boy was going to lose the match. Not really. Much too sedate a pastime for me. Also, it's simply not that challenging. The moves are always so obvious. Why does no one else see it? Goodbye, Imelda. Nice meeting you. I love you, Imelda. What do you think? I find its location a little untoward myself. Made the mistake of leaving my potion in the common room. I'm convinced Peeves absconded with it. What do you Someone's think? Someone's practicing the I, I think I heard one. Looked like a war had broken out. Hmm. Doubt mermaids find us that interesting. Are you blind? Ah. Based on all the chatter when you entered the common room, I'm guessing you're oh, yeah, a you're blind. here. I'm Ominous. Ominous? ominous? Nice to meet you, Ominous. Sorry, the well, blind you kid's certainly name had a memorable ominous? arrival. Well, if I'm going to make my mark here, I had to start right away. <laughs> you're definitely in the right house. Do let me know if I can be of any yes. help as you navigate your Just first like fucking phase, am. Though I doubt you'll need it. Did that student say he thought he heard a mermaid? <laughs> yes, but I've never heard of a mermaid showing up outside our common room window. It is fun to play along though. Been known to keep some first years on the lookout for hours. Were you expecting to be sorted into Slytherin? Most certainly. My family on my father's side are direct descendants of Salazar Slytherin. One the of heir? the four founders of Hogwarts. Not something I'm especially proud of, mind you. He was obsessed with blood status. A pure blood maniac. Unfortunately, most of his descendants do not fall far from that tree. We shall kill them. Thank you, what Ominous. A weird place Very to nice to meet you. Pleasure was all Especially mine. Especially when your name is Don't be a stranger. Ominous. Is the new fifth year Slytherin in here? Professor Weasley's waiting for you just by the stairs. Coming! <laughs> I love Slytherin! Come on, guys, let's learn today. Yeah. Most people walk up into their rooms, not down, and I love that. Good morning. I trust you're ready for your first day at Hogwarts? I've been dreaming of this day for a long time. Can't believe I'm here. Well, you are here. Make the most of it. You only have one first day at Hogwarts. Now, in light of your unique situation, yeah, like, it's joining us hot. as a fifth year, you'll all. need to catch up with your classmates and not fall behind. Especially as you'll be expected to complete your OWLs at the end of the year. OWLs? Owls? Yes, your ordinary wizarding level exams. They will determine <laughs> the type of career one, huh? you can have when you leave here. After much discussion with the headmaster and the Department of Magical Education at the Ministry, We've devised something extraordinary to ensure your success. That sounds like cheating. Here you are. Is this... 
What is it? Is it, it is cheating? a wizard's field guide. It will help you to keep track of what you are learning so that you master all that's expected of a fifth year. You would be wise to take full advantage of this exceptionally valuable resource. That's a slither and I shall exploit it for game. Thank you, Professor, but what do you mean it will keep track of what I'm learning? Perhaps seeing it in action will answer any questions you may have. Are you Walk with me and we shall put it to the test. This way. Is she the head of the Hogwarts house? I'm sure she goes to whatever, like... Of course she's supposed to be your, like, liaison, but... She's wearing all green. And it would be a fun play if it's just like, Hey, remember the Weasleys! <laughs> They're this, like... Old matriarch used to be, uh... Slytherin headmistress. I apologize for that. I need more agua. So we'll talk about one. I might grab myself like throw something to nibble on. Nothing crazy. Not like going to make a meal or anything, but I'll have a nice steak.
here is the problem. I cracked open myself a can of Vienna sausages, and the cats were like, oh, I hear that can sound. I know what that is. That's my cat food. When it was absolutely no not their cat food. I certainly would have appreciated something like the field guide when I was a student. Using the guide will also train you to be alert to your surroundings. Okay. Revelio. The guide will give you opportunities to practice your magic and educate yourself about wizarding lore. Law? Do keep up. Okay. Is this beside? Why don't you cast Revelio? Revelio. And see what details the field guide can provide. Oh, okay. It's one of, so it's a collection thing. Field get challenges are the only way to acquire experience points. Okay. Okay. Remove requirement challenges, exploration quest, and combat. Okay. Hogwarts regalia spectacles. Uh huh. Okay. Pretty straightforward. Clever, isn't it? Keep your Rebellion. eyes open for more opportunities like that, inside and outside of the castle. I just realized that chest had uh, eyes that were looking at me. I'm eating my Vienna sausages and smuggle trash food. I grabbed that in a banana and I'm just now realizing I've got two foul guys. I made a fool of them. Imagine how terrifying it would be not being in Slytherin. Revelio. Ah, good timing. Perfect opportunity to show you how to use flu flames to get around a bit quicker. Your field guide mm. contains a map of the castle. Open it up and find Central Hall. Okay. Okay. Cool. And here we are, quite the time saver. These stairs lead directly to Central Hall. You can get almost anywhere in the castle quickly from Central Hall. Always 
something happening here. It's the heart of the hive. Our King's Cross Station, so to speak. Come on, is that... When did King's Cross Station open? A unicorn! Revelio. That should be all for now. You'll be expected to attend both Charms and Defense Against the Dark Arts classes today. And I'd like to be sure you get to Hogsmeade as soon as possible to replace the supplies you lost on the way here. What will I learn in Charms class? Exactly what you might expect. Spells, charms, jinxes, all terribly useful. I think you will enjoy Professor Ronan. He's a clever and entertaining wizard and Ronan. a talented teacher. Another word that means something. Can you tell me more about the Defense what? Against the Dark Arts Lost class? Defense Against the Dark Arts, as the name implies, focuses on how to defend oneself against the evils that lurk beyond these walls. A mastery of Defense Against the Dark Arts is required for those her? who aspire to become Auras. Fortunately, we are lucky to have the ever-gifted Professor Hecate in charge of our students' education in Hecate. that regard. You mentioned Hogsmeade, Professor. Hogsmeade is the only all-wizarding village in Britain and is home to an array of shops and pubs. You should be able to find all of the school supplies you require in Hogsmeade. You will also, I imagine, <coughs> enjoy many a butterbeer there with <coughs> friends in due course. Thank you, Professor Weasley. A lot to absorb on your first day, and you have much to learn. Happily, your professors have agreed to create additional assignments for you outside of class. Mm. You'll be up to speed in no oh. time. Okay. Judging by your not, adept not use of thinking. Revelio earlier, I'd say Professor Fig succeeded in at least showing you the basics. Well, fuck you. He did, Professor. He's been terribly vague as to the events preceding your arrival, specifically about what happened after that awful dragon attack. My suspicion is that there's more to the story than a search for belongings and an extended trip up to the castle. We did take a bit of a detour on the way here. Ended up exploring some ruins and... I shouldn't say more. Exploring ruins? Well, I presume Professor Fig has his reasons for keeping the details to himself for now. Speak of the devil, Professor Fig. You need to tell him about Your the ruins. Must have been burning. Did you, oh, boy? Yes. You seem to have provided our new fifth year with a solid foundation in the basics of spellcasting. Ah, I'm afraid I can't take all the credit there, Professor. They've a rare aptitude for magic, it seems. Hmm. Well, I'm just glad you both arrived in one piece. Perfectly like good boats sun. and carriages to Hogwarts, and you chose to fly in the path of a dragon. I wouldn't say I chose the dragon's path, Professor. Rather unfortunately, it would seem that it chose us. Very well. Enough chit-chat. I need to get to class myself. Might I rely on you, Professor Fig, to explain the details of the field guide's map? Of course. Thank you. Good luck today. And remember to use your field guide. It will be invaluable to you. And invaluable to me, as I'll be using it to keep up to date on your progress. Yes, Professor. Come and find me in my classroom after you've attended both classes today, and I'll explain more about those assignments I mentioned. And we'll see if we can't get you to Hogsmeade for those supplies. So from what I've understood, it's not like a bully situation where it's like, you've got X, 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 and X to do today. <coughs> it's more like a mission, submission, side missions thing. Like sometimes your main mission will be to go to a class, and sometimes the classes are on a side burner, back burner, side mission thing. But it is, it is very much uh, the shit you do on the sides rewards the main, and you know that's what I'm about. You know that's my thing. You know I'm all about decisions mattering. You know I'm all about like if you do the little, the lot is better.
All right, I'm back. I had to pet my babies. So, collections. Okay. Cool. Ooh. Okay. I'm going to equip it for now. <gasps> the German glasses. The Red Baron, 38 confirmed area victories. Oh, cool, blimey, welcome to Hogwarts. I just there it is and then I can change its appearance hey guess what side I'm on gang guess what si guess what side I'm on None of it actually has any real value. Revelio. It's good to see you, Professor. And you. I was hoping our paths would cross today before you immersed yourself in studies. Did I hear you and Professor Weasley talking about exploring ruins? She caught me off guard. I didn't tell her anything else about our travels here. I will say, I think she suspects we're not being entirely forthcoming. Yes, well, Professor Weasley is a brilliant and astute witch. Yep. It was right Damn to right keep the is. details to yourself for now. We don't know where this path we've embarked upon will lead. Greatness. It may require Glory a bit more for me. flexibility you with your time than she would approve of. And she may feel obliged to share details with the headmaster that would be better left between us. I'm not going to suck your dick, Professor. dude. Good. Now, as capable as you are, I believe the ability you weird. possess obliges you to be well-trained. Happily, you have the benefit of an exceptionally skilled team of witches and wizards to guide you. Speaking of guides, and so that I may avoid another not-so-subtle reproof from Professor Weasley, why don't I show you the clever enchantment we included in the field guides map? Unfold it and have a look. Okay. That the only way to gain XP was to whatever. Okay. One Accio. The map is enchanted to help you find oh, your duh. way. This will be incredibly helpful. Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious How rocket. How old was Ollivander? Now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. A 
Okay. Cool. Cool. Rebellion. There it is. We got goblins. I wouldn't bother yourself uh, about that. Already I unlocked I rewards? Apparently I'm right next to one. So they gave you two different variants on the uh, the Harry Potter glasses. Guess what side I'm on. and better fettle. I like Thomas Brown. He always takes the time to show me where all the new books are. Oh, I bought one from him. Ugh, what am I missing? Lenora. Hello. I, I don't believe we've met. Oh, hello. Fuck off, I'm Lenora. bitch. I don't like you. Pardon me if I seem a little distracted at the moment. No worries. Everyone I'm thinks I'm utterly balmy. Samantha thinks I'm potty. But it's this painting. I never noticed it before. If I know Hogwarts, and I do, an empty frame doesn't appear for no reason. There's something more to this. Have you gained hmm. any insights about the painting since you've been studying it? I did discover that casting Lumos has an effect of some kind. But I'm not sure what to do next. I do. Are there any other empty paintings like this around the school? Yes, a few. This entire place is somewhat of a riddle, to be honest. If I can work out the riddle of this one, I'll know what to do with all of them. As good a place as any to begin. If I have I the time, I, I may look. It. Could be intriguing. <sighs> I've been racking my brains long enough. I hope you'll have better I luck than I have. it's one of those things that it's like instantly solvable. Oh, do it, come I'm and find me if you stumble on something illuminating that solves That spot must be a clue. I should look around in case it's nearby. Big faggot underneath the stairs. No better for you than plunging your hands in the greenhouse soil. Unless you accidentally uproot the main man. Morning. This looks like the location from the painting. Let's get you back to your frame, little moth. Easy, peasy, breezy, beautiful, Jeep, Jeep Grand Cherokee. We're, we're here. Ha! I knew there was a connection. I should tell Lenora that I solved the puzzle of that empty frame. Plus 15 HP? Alright, and a level 2. You're not gonna, like, tell me about it? Tell me what I learned there? Oh, because it wasn't a field guide? Maybe it was a quest? No. Did I get an item? Hey. What is it? Oh, 
talking about? Okay, I'm here. You're feeling feisty, aren't you? Even after all that praying we've done and all that belly full of wet food you got, you're still feeling energetic? You gonna nest in the fit of wires again? Skivers. Wait, did I just turn it off? No. I did it. Lenora, I solved the mystery of that painting. You did? How? I found the location depicted in the painting, and then I cast Lumos to guide a moth back to the frame. All very logical, to I suppose. Frame. Pity I was so close to solving it. You have a knack for solving riddles. Natty's good at that too. So is Amit, although he does tend to over-explain. Well, I'm glad someone figured it out. The moth! I should have seen that! I'm gonna get lost probably and just exploring for a little bit. Oh my god, that breath I was hearing this entire time was the dragon. And this is why everybody has always wanted a Hogwarts game. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, I am supposed to go that way. Sorry. I heard the screaming over here. That night's moving. Yep. Sorry, I'm going to go up here to get this flume. Let me think. Rebellion. That's got to be like a thing. We're gonna, because I've seen a lot of those moving around. What, have you done? what are you up to now? But this wasn't what I meant at all. Well, are you happy now? Oh, please wait. <laughs> Rebellion. I'm assuming we're gonna have like a like Leviosa or something's gonna Whoa. Zero, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Well that's a code. Question mark. Plus Hydra plus two equals fourteen. Revelio. Um, how do I? Is there...
Huh. Okay. There it is. Three. So... 14. So, 2 plus that 3. So that's 9. So, ugh, Leviathan, got it. I think that one was just to show me how it's done. That plus that plus that equals... Okay. So... Okay. Oh, hey, baby. Yeah. She's chilling at my feet. I'm a smart boy. I'm just going to work smarter, not harder. Get out of here. Okay. Yep. Go all the way back. All right. Now this one. Two. And then that is three. And then it all equals nine. So that's four. I'm looking for four. Right, that's four. Okay. And then three, which is the hydro we've been seeing the entire time. There we go. Not hard at all. In fact, if I wasn't 12.30 on a day, I had five and a half hours of sleep, had had a glass of wine and other, you know, work and everything bothering me. Ooh. Collection updated. High art. What am I getting? Oh, that's... If I were to take a guess... durations cool cool like I like that like you're literally learning things that increase your power like you would what have I discovered Revelio Whitman C classroom guide this classroom is where students learn about the magical properties of numbers and numerology Though a great many opt instead to spend the period counting moon glaives whilst nodding off in the desk. Revelio. Okay. So, like, why not? Okay, so that's five salamander? Six 
So that's 11. And then that thing is 4, which is Tweety Bird. Got it. 13. 18. The Sloth, which is 0. And then 5 is Weird Boy. Reveal your secrets. Hell yeah! I have the refined drilling blade. Oh, I was really hoping that was gonna. Like, a part of me thought it said it like if you can read this, but then that was something else entirely. Crap! None. Revelio. Six plus that, which is five, so that's eleven, so I need six. Which is a salamander. Okay. Eight plus the hell is that? Seven. So I'm looking for one. Which is, as we all know, unicorn. Bam, baby. Those scratches suggest someone was locked in here. Whoa, hold on. <laughs> Um, why did you make that joke, Hogwarts? It's... I fucking love this classroom. Revelio. Like clocks and numbers is my aesthetic, and the mix with the astron- Oh, so cool. I love this whole, like, no, you gotta pass the test to get into the classroom. And this is why you explore. Lumos. Protego. Nine. But that's also the game's way of saying, oh, exploring too much, are we? <laughs> oh, you coward. Revelio. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Are you me? Oh! It's the platypus again. This is the divination <sighs> tower, isn't it? Yeah. Boy, bruv, this is a loading screen if I've ever seen one, it is. <sighs> Rebellion! Model of a hand is to Mars say to help students in the pack. Ah, it either has a considerable lifeline or is likely to die in a fortnight. Hello, I would really love to talk to you, but I'm assuming since that you don't have anything to say, that that means you'll be important later. Rebellio. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, Professor Black Section is my honor's deputy headmistress. Toffee, the position of divination. Aww. I thought that was a head on the table for a second. Hello, ma'am. 
I'm like anxiously waiting to hear about whoever you are. Cause you got that, that like augury vibe. That like the divination people have that I love. How nice to see you, my young friend. And how nice to see you, my darling. Oh. Let me <laughs> do more classes now, explore more later. Oh my. Around the world, around the world. <gasps> Oh, come on. Let me turn a few things off. Down again. this stuff being high, so I'll sacrifice it. Like, so I'll slowly tweak everything else downwards. Because I love those, those long distances. Yeah, there we go. Instantly better. Granted, it also could have been loading. Well, but either way. It looks great for it. I'm not turning anything down. Oh, uh, hello. Big dick Revelio. You gotta stop just doing Revelio all the time. Nice. Lumos. What do we have there? We have pillars. Nice summer scene, an archway. Jamming. The holidays. You can never have too many fairy lights, in my opinion. Off on another adventure, are we? It's like that's not even. What I, I love that I found defense against the dark arts when that's not even what I was looking to do. Oh, what are you? The poltergeist? Lumos. Fills our stout hearts with joy to be in the presence of such arrogance. Not sure he's in Is at the me? present moment, the Edmaster. Would be sure to tell him how very much you despise him. I love just yeah. Getting you can't these. imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented flu powder. 
<laughs> Why do students always run when Peavesy wants to have some fun? I never knew he was like human human. <laughs> or like looking, like I thought he was more ghostly. I feel like this is where it would Lumos. be. Perhaps you can meet me after Herbology and show me how I'm supposed to do that thing with the soil. I feel like I've gotten too far away. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. She's just so quaint and lovely. Also gotta remember I'm looking for that archway that goes with this. Lumos. I don't know what that means, and it sounds like an insult. It looked like that. Another one. Revelio. Pungent passes. This passion is relatively nondescript as far as passes go. However, the mishandling would crop them. The unfairness of being hung here. Why it warrants looking into people grumbling about a foul smell. Ooh. Yeah, wait, why are they here? That is awful. Fine, I'm going to go do that one in a second. The fact that that other one was right there leads me to believe. Revelio, Lumos, Revelio. There it is. Lumos. I don't know if this is the right bathroom for me to be in. Well, somebody appears to be making what I can only assume is a reference to. That, that answers that. Can I? Is it beautiful? I'm not sure what kind of look you call that. Interesting. Revelio. Lumos. What are you up to now? Oh, it's the men's room, is it? Because it's got the pisser. Revelio. Lumos. Revelio. There it is. Cool. Well, this is the path. Uh, this is the place where the defense against the dark arts was. 
when it was uh, the charms guy, the phony. Revelio. Come on, me. Just I could sense a chest. Hey, dude. Release that man from that jar immediately. Come on. I didn't want to be screwing with the gear this much this early. But luxurious cloak, you say? Three offense, no upgrades applied. So it's just simply a matter of taste at this point. Oh, yes. My powers are growing. Rebellion. All right, let me go. Protego. Lumos. said that travel broadens the mind. Yeah, that makes sense. You're the flu powder lady. God, I love that they do that. There it is. Just under me. And I have a little footstool here. And I raised it up and down real fast. And then I realized she's laying right underneath it. And I almost squashed her. Squashed her little bones. Okay. Off on another adventure, are we? No, I saw another one of these. Revelio. Where was the door? God damn it, all these doors are starting to like. Look alike. Yes, it was this staircase then. Further. Yeah, I think it was through this one. The pungent hall. Yep. Okay. Lumos. Painting of a If you could card. just tread carefully, that's all I ask. Here we go. See, this one didn't take long at all. Dapper mob on some ball. <laughs> Thank you, darling. Give me those points, baby. I, I have even more HP. Revelio. I have yet to have any use Handy for it. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Of course. Lady. 
Who's the gray lady? Revelio. I think there's more to be revealed here later. Survives the reign of this headmaster. I think we should have a moon calf in charge. Rebellion. Bit of snot on your nose. Thought you'd want to know. I love those guys. Best friends. Alright. Spin that wheel. Augury yeah. skeleton. Revelio. Oh, that was the one I can't get into. Rebellion. I keep hearing it, but I can't. I don't. I don't know. Right. You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was. Oh, all right. I feel like there it is. Serpentine beast window of silence. I think this window was somehow a tribute to their house founder. It's actually a serpent and beast coil of under tree that extends from the mouth of the legendary green man. Ooh, 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 I completed a challenge. Oh, big stretch. I get some more handware. Don't mind if I do. I'm going to show up stacked to my first class. I'm going to show up with the Hogwarts Regalia gloves, it looks like. Oh, hold on. This might be an appearance thing. For those dark arts gloves, they look nice. Revelio. Eventually, Ooh, there it is. Oh, yeah. It was one of those beast ones. Salazar. Professor Ronan tends to go on a bit. We sometimes have to remind him to finish the lesson. Some of us don't necessarily want him to get back to the lesson. I hear it's run by house elves. Have you been to the island? What's wrong with house elves? Oh, no. Revelio, my young friend. Where were you? Where were you? In the Goblin Rebellion of 1752. And by the end of it, the Minister for Magic was Albert Booth. Is this part of the game? Yes. Important gameplay. Important gameplay. Top tier game. 
didn't know we'd get such a high game of the year contender so early. Peeves, you weird pervert. Get out of here. Revelio. And you're both wrong anyway. It was Hephaestus Gore. It wasn't Boots and it wasn't Flack, but you're all in trouble with Professor Black. <laughs> okay. Zero, three, uh, two is the dragon. One plus four sets five, so seven. <coughs> Which is, of course, octopus looking. It's a guy. Okay. I wasn't expecting to find more of these through the castle, but it's kind of cool that they did. Like, I honestly feel like I'm making real discoveries, and that's fucking cool. Stylish, casual. And I'm done yet. Uh, I kind of want to just look over what I got. Something Love Good talked about once. Right. Straight up calling it at a quest item, huh? That makes sense. That way you don't, like, get rid of it. So two, oh, doesn't have a level three trait, but the defense is better. it for a second. God damn. What am I, marching into battle? I do like it, though. Ooh. Mix that. This. Yes. We are building a top-tier warrior. Revelio. The guy I saw? Eating more dreams. Nice. Whoa. Whoa. I understand why it was taking a minute. I'm I'm sorry I was unkind. Revelio! of Barnabas the Barmy. This happened to be a wizard. Barnabas the Barmy's foolish attempt to train tolls for the ballet. One can only imagine the impact on the arts had he succeeded. God. Underappreciated in his time. Hey, the headmaster's statue follows you. Revelio. That's kind of screwed up. <gasps> Astronomists. A 
I think the problem is I am straight running through this fate place at a rate it does not appreciate. What are you up to now? It's probably some Rebellion. small reference to an actual astronomer. But I'm a too stupid to know what it is. I mean, I gotta say, like, in a game... Revelio. In an era where, like, modern-day games are just not released complete... The fact that this game's complete and just a little clunky to load... Lumos. Lumos. Hello. This is my first day and I'm really not supposed to be here. Hey. Well, this has got to be a Harry Potter reference. I mean, I know the whole game is a Harry Potter reference, but that owl and Airwell in particular. Maybe that's my owl, because there was an owl on the back of it. Maybe it found its way here. Revelio. Beautiful. Lumos. Come on. It looks like code. Maybe it's like waiting there and like a main storyline will bring me to it. I'm supposed to be like, oh, hourly! Or whatever. God damn. I'm doing good. Revelio. There was a chest at the bottom of the stairs. That I cannot forget to acquire. Whoa. That nearly had less neck. You look like you're old, even though you're child size. Is it possible to become an aura and not accept? It's all about isn't it? I want to be the kid Rebellion. rocking out of the nightcap. I think I shall be. Off on another adventure, are we? Almost always, lady. I need to get some dragon hide gloves for her bology. I refuse to handle tiny chomping cabbages. Oh, fuck yeah. So I'm not like locked into. Okay, good. Good. I love. I, oh, fuck. I'm locked out, anyways. 
I hate when you're like, oh, I need to go in that room. I'm like, oh, you gotta go through the quest marker. My brother caused a lot of trouble in Professor Weeping. Okay. Let's do this thing. Let's learn some spells, baby. Here. Behind you. There is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. I love how Have diverse you met Hogwarts is yet? for like nineteen <clears throat> hundred. Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome England. to year five of Charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right now, Stupid. everyone, please open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change <coughs> and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm? Uh, 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 uh. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Well, well, I mean, it how, seems how dare anybody here tell me? Review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Did anybody say I was going to be ill Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. Accio. Accio. That is not bad. Thank you. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. I well, just as you all one. seem to have the basics down, and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. Okay. I figure I'll do this, and then I'll do Defense Against the Dark Arts, and then we'll go from there. But I'm getting pretty tired. I have five hours of sleep, so it's like probably <sighs> less, actually. I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport? And I'm getting quiet our now. prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> I love that we're outside on our first day. <laughs> so why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? What? Huh? What game? Are we playing bocce ball? <laughs> kind of want to go over there and get that flu shoot powder thingy. Very simply, cast Accio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Now, uh, think of this like gobstones, if you will. But instead of throwing the marbles out, you are summoning them toward you. The trick is to pull the sphere as far as possible, but not a bit more, or it'll fall, yes? Now, I could keep talking about theory all day, but practice is the best, Professor. Show us how it's done. Okay. 
Come on. Akio! That's it! Don't lose your composure! Excellent good happens to the best of us. Splendid! Not to worry. Very good! Points to Slytherin! But there's certainly no sport in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you to care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up! You'll be the blues, just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Here we go! There we go. Okay. Akio! Stop! Stay focused! Lisa. Okay. Um... Yeah, none of that helps me. Collections? Tools, traits, one in enemy appearances, conservations, ingredients. Uh, where's my spell list? Everyone is watching, but try not to be nervous. You are doing quite well. Akio. No, now you'll stop. Fuck off. Watch this. Almost like it wouldn't let me do well. It's like you heard me mashing that button. Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? Naked ladies, gunfire, lightning storm, dragons. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Let us see this. Here. Very good. Here we go. Yes. Oh, it's impossible for me to win now. Akio. Nicely done. That sucks. It sucks that I like 
finally understood the gist of the spell like halfway through Very the practice. Very good, both of you. Well done. I was mashing like four again, and it was just like, I'm going to pull it closer. I'm just like, would you not, please? <sighs> Hello. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Well done back there. You took the loss in stride. Didn't want to go too easy on you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. I'm holding my own. That's good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, oh, we had left now. Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. Is Wagadu much bigger than Hogwarts? <laughs> Wagadu School of Magic is the largest wizarding school in the world. So yes, bigger than Hogwarts. But it never seemed intimidating or overwhelming to me. It always felt like home. Is Wagadu a castle like Hogwarts? Its address is Mountains of the Moon. It is not so much a castle as a beautiful edifice carved out of the mountainside. I remember the first what a time weird I saw address. it, How do you get the mist was so thick, I could hardly make out <coughs> anything at all. How do you get there? And then it just materialized before me, this enormous school that seemed to be floating in midair. <clears throat> this may seem an odd question, but is magic the same there as it is here? Mm, mostly, yes. But I did have to learn how to use a wand when I arrived here. Hardly anyone at Wagadu uses one. Surely the magic is weaker. You can cast spells without a wand. Oh, yes. I find wandless magic to be much more instinctive. Not to mention quite convenient if one is without their wand. I must admit, however, that I am growing quite fond of using a wand. It seems very dramatic. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, so I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. I don't want to be racist here, but you're saying that black people waiting. are just better at magic? Until next time. Because that seems pretty racist. Of course, you can use Akio on humans. A word, if you're, if you're so inclined. Well, After my brother learned the summoning charm, it was constant Akio this, Akio that, cutlery flying everywhere. Quite unsafe, really. Professor Ronan reminds me of my grandfather. Loads of... I'm going to be a piece of shit. <clears throat> Excuse me. I used chronomancy to go back in time. Very simply, cast Akio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm Akio at possible moment. Now, uh, think of this like gobstones, if you will. But instead of throwing the marbles out, you are summoning them toward you. That's it! Splendid! Perfect. Yeah, now that I know how to actually. Very good! Do it. Points to Slytherin! But there's certainly no sport in playing Miss Onai. Would you care to give up? Come on up! You'll be the blues just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. 
clear? Yes, sir. As, and she's basically 30, 30, 30. So as long as I hit a 50 once, I'm good. There we go. Akio. Excellent control there. Watch this. Game's getting that a little jealous. Nice. Quite nice. Impressive. All I have to do is score a ten. <laughs> Easy. Akio. No show voting, just a victory. That's it. Hero protagonist. Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? Now this is this one actually is gonna be because I do have to pay attention to those. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Here we go. There we Let's go. Start strong with the 50. Akio. No, no, no! Happens to the best of us. Watch this. I reconnected to her when I really should not have. Alright, I need 50 50. I hate myself for doing this. It's like, I do really good at getting it right, and then it's just like, why not fuck it up? <laughs> I can do it. That was the issue. It's just. You'll be the blues oh, just God. as before. I'm Damn it. I did not mean you to go are back this red. far. Clear? Yes, sir. All right. Sorry about this. No more screwing about. Let's just make this right. Let's just get it Let done. See this. You're gonna start off with a 50. That is how it's done. I think the game's getting pissed at me. I'm getting pissy with me. It's almost like. There's an aggression to it, but sometimes it's just like little, 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 and I'm just sort of like, it's going faster. You'll be the blues just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Hey, babies. Cheers. Lisa. There it is. Very good. Here we go. <coughs> so she gets an, a 50 <laughs> at least once every time. Well done. Let us see this. There we go. 
You bitch. Akio. One perfect score. Remarkable. Let's make this a well, bit I like more that he interesting, had a, a shall we? Interesting dialogue line for that. <laughs> I think we are well past interesting at this point. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. Don't face This me round again, settles bitch. it all. Be sharp. Okay, now I feel like a schmuck. Akio. Excellent. Now I feel like I'm what fucking I hate cherry picking it like that, because that's not what it was. She normally is a fucking brand competitor. Yes! <coughs> not like this. I don't think she has any way to win. But I am still going for that perfect score. of you. Yes. Well done. It's almost like I've uh, done it before. <laughs> oh, my babies. I love you. Buttercup, mommy pen. Class is dismissed. Jimmy. Gather your things on the way out. What's happening, you beautiful Good game, bastards? Master. Thanks for coming. I must admit, Welcome for joining. I think I underestimated you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. I... I did just win, so that was weird that she said that. Thank you, but I've been holding my own. I appreciate your confidence. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. Okay. My... Um, Is Wag I want to ask all these questions just because I did earlier. Wag when I went back in time, I erased this... that and I want to make sure that... Spells cast without a wand must be less powerful than those cast with a wand. No, no, not at all. Wizarding magic cast without a wand is just as powerful. Why? I find wandless magic to be much more in. I must. That makes no sense. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hog. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants. Until next time. Of course, you can use Akio. Professor Ronan reminds me of my grandfather. Loads of wisdom. Well. I love that you see these kids through all, all the After same my schools. brother learned the summoning charm, it was constant Akio this, Akio that. You see the same kids over and over. flying fun. everywhere. Quite one place, really. Hello. You wanted to speak with me, Professor? I did. I trust your first charms Even lesson more so, lived up but to expectation. Even more so. Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit 
distracted of late. <clears throat> Why? Now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am why? preparing why for you. Why would Professor Weasley do that? Makes sense that Fig would, but why would he? Ooh, I gained a lot there. I'm going to be honest with you. It's just like combat gloves. Now, nah, got to keep the dark arts. Hey! How are you? Charludio? Love that. It rolls off the tongue. Hello there. You're the new student, aren't you? Have we not spoke already? Hello. You wanted to speak to me? Samantha Dale. I've been eager to meet you. You're the student everyone's been whispering about. That's Hope me, baby. Hope your first day is going well. You certainly seem to hold your own in charms. God, pretty good. I'm doing all right. Can't complain. Been a busy couple of days. January was... A stressful month, but we're doing better now. Now, I'm playing the bad guy, so it wasn't too challenging. Thank you, but it really wasn't all that challenging. My brother William would tell you not to be so humble and to trust your abilities. Then again, he tends to be a bit overconfident in his. Well, better see to my charms homework. Was what I, I said? find Professor Ronan's lessons a bit more challenging than you do. What I said was not humble in any way. Was there a side quest available to me? <laughs> Charlotte. Of course, Charlotte. Just like the web. I appreciate that. Thank you. Appreciate the follow. Ooh, ooh. Slytherins are what now? Next to the lake. Water is so soothing. I suppose one could smuggle a pet into the dormitory if one was willing to use a disillusionment charm. Give me the key, please. Top tier gameplay. It's a bummer there's no dogs, but like something about this place just lends itself to cats. Now, there's a side quest here. Tell you what, I am right next to Defense Against the Dark Arts. So I think it would make more sense to do that. Honestly. Handy resource indeed. Hmm. What about yourself? Do you play anything? What sort of games you play? Or like watching? This is just such a good representation of what I imagine it would be like to be in Hogwarts, which I think is what any kid who grew up playing the games, I mean, playing the games, reading the books or watching the movies. Can I go into the room this time? Nope, I gotta do the quest first this time. Got. Hey, Sebastian! Leviosa! Professor Hecate! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. 
<laughs> it was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. No. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Yeah, sure. No, well, let's tell me something. To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Something with this Levioso. Levioso. A levitation charm. Levioso. A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? <laughs> One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. What is an unspeakable? Oh, I love this. I gotta be good. Well, I'm getting better at this. It's Leviosa, not Leviosa. Leviosa. Now, let's try Why something a little like larger. A What sort of things? Let us begin Ooh. with a basic cast. I just thought of something. I wonder if V-Sync is on. That always causes problems. Bam. Got to turn that off as well. Probably helped. See how the dump deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Okay. Remember, a surprised opponent is a weak opponent, as Master Pruitt so artfully helped me demonstrate earlier. Levioso. Well done. I want to be Way to practice is My whole by point dueling. was I was supposed to just keep doing that? We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. Time for a proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. Protego and Levioso. <laughs> Levioso! Good ball. I know. This will be your first duel. Let's just say I'm a quick learner. You're good. Protego, no, let me I do enjoy you, my duel. Yes. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. <laughs> I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Slytherin. Yes. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the Given opportunity 20 points to practice. To Slytherin today. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. Evil things. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it. I've been slowly sinking into being a nice guy it. with people, and I gotta a remember I'm playing an evil person. Thing, but I'm like, save the goodness for when you're playing a Ravenclaw nerd. Or as ever more likely, goblins. 
is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. I love your Understood, slang, Professor. magic lady. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Are we going to start an underground well fighting ring? Today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. Got it. Start killing the weaker kids. Understood. All right. That I'd hate to face Professor Hecate in a duel. I'll kill the bitch. Oh, I'm not much for dueling. I prefer to keep things... Rebellion. When do I get to open locks and start being a real creep? A billion points to Slitheruff. If you know the right spells, it's dark wizards that'll fear you, not the other way around. You drooled Sebastian. He's strong competition. Well done. I like that, like, the, the students repeat. Nice too. work. We, we'll I enjoyed that. Muggles. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? Felt more like I was dueling an expert. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Hey, then yeah, again, Slytherin gotta look out perhaps for each other. this wasn't your first duel. I've dueled enough. Consider yourself lucky I held back. Huh, fair enough. You owe me an honest duel when you aren't. You know. You might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive Did my unsanctioned dueling here to organization. Join this unsanctioned dueling competition? Exclusive and unsanctioned. Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. I fucking love this. Whether kid. it's joining a secret dueling club. Or sneaking into the restricted section I of the am library. Big in that. You just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck. I'll kill you. Or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Till no. next time. That probably unlocks. Another side quest. <laughs> Rebellion. Huh. Always thought Levioso was for first years. Not anymore. I like having the post, uh, post mission chats with everybody. I mean, post class chats. Ooh. Quests on different sides of the school. I haven't been over here yet. So for the sake of exploration, um, and just knocking out a side quest, let's just do it. And I know I said I thought I was going to wrap it up, but I hit a second wind. And I think I'm going to keep on going. For it. I'm probably already drastically over level. Nothing. Man, this place is cool. Where's my poltergeist friend? I feel like every every time I speak his name, he arises. I, I saw another one of those flying. This has got to be one, right? Revelio. Oh. <coughs> I got a shoot over here, though. How nice. nice to see you, my young friend. Akio. Of course it's Accio. I'm a Rebellion. big dumb dummy head. 
Levioso! Revelio. I walked by one of those earlier. There's so much to snag. Are you fucking kidding me right now? Oh, it's really only changing the pants. I'm like big head Rebellion. Logan. Oh, that's cool. What's the chimney to the Hufflepuff room? Right. I saw... Oh, I might have just seen those butterflies. Like, did I see another book over here? So I traveled so far over this way, it's like, alright, yeah, actually, it's faster to go this way now, kid. Which is kind of cool, because... Rebellion! Oh, yeah, if I'm just kind with the game and give it time to load, it's actually not... all that awful. Whoop! I have heard that this is like an issue. Like I said, it's not you something. You can't imagine how inconvenient. Oh, I invented blue powder. Where is it? Ah. Has it now? Oop! And then, of course, another one Rebellion. over here. Why does it say as well as? As if he isn't. I've always wanted to know. Ah, here we go. I'm sorry, isn't there supposed to be a doorway here? That Snape retreated out of one time? Ah, yes. Get back to work! Revelio. Lumos. That's... I mean, that's obviously right over here. Ah. Come on now! Hee hee hee! I'm a Slytherin! Yay! Back to that. Whee! I'm evil. Even though this looks gleefully. Just don't worry about it. I'm level five already. Ah, perfect. Rebellion. I'm assuming that's connected with the puzzles that we're about to- Ooh! It's <gasps> a Triwizard? Not Triwizard, it's the house stuff. Yeah! I mean, you're not gonna have the point values up? Rebellion. I want to go. I 
I get access to that? Oh, here we are. Let me listen. Just go and get rid of all the paintings. I completed a challenge. Yet again. Hogwarts regalia hat. Ooh. I'm gonna look. I'm like, I'm gonna start stunting on these fools almost immediately. That is my plan. Ah, this one Rebellion. is not a ladder. I mean, stairs. Not a ladder. So, three plus. That is. No, that one's nine. Nine plus seven is sixteen, which means we need eight, which means we need a spider for that one. And then eleven and sloth is three. And then we need uh, hydra. So. What is that? Nine, sixteen. Uh, spider, and then hydra. Go it. Go it. Open up. Yes. Niffler statue and a loosened cobalt runic scar. Like, I'm burning through gear pretty quickly here, so I'm gonna just... Gotta be level 7 to wear that. Whoa. Oh, I thought that was orange for a second. Hell yeah, I'm looking like a crazy RPG character. Which is kind of the goal, to be honest. Accio! Lumos! Accio! It put me back on the course to... Oh, no. Okay. No, 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 no. It is going over there. It, I saw the yellow one. I was just like, it's going to take me to the main story. Rebellion. Never tickle a sleeping dragon. I love how I'm definitely going to have to go through every place again. But how that's A-OK. -okay. And I'll enjoy myself. Renaissance cap. Rebellion! It's a downgrade. I mean, they always do that. I don't know why you're acting surprised. The fuck did I make my way into the catacombs? Is this is the Chamber of Secrets. Ha <laughs> it is the Chamber of Secrets.
Revelio. Uh huh. Come on, oh, Tazzle, what now? Oh, Tazzle, Koofy? I'm pretty sure that's a slur in some places. Oh, it's a little bit of a downgrade, though. Oh, not this one, though. Lumos. Feel like that's the direction I just came from. There it is. Soundtrack's banging, by the way. Give me that. I didn't... That's a door, it's just... That's probably one of... Revelio. Common rooms, now that I think about it. We have a locked door, a locked door, and then a locked door. So I'm glad I came down here. Yeah, of course, it's the chest behind there. Revelio. Now this has got to be the Slytherin area. It is indeed. Oh, we didn't come out this way last time. Nice! Get us hit. Excited. I love when the little kitties are curled up together. They're adorable little sisters. game for me is just like, hey, do you want to play the game? I'm like, no, Hogwarts simulator, bitch. Revelio. I'm out of here. Oh, this we've been in here before. Revelio. Did I? Oh yeah, that's right. Nope, didn't go in here. Lumos. Well, clearly. Bunch of current photos. Let out the light. That's weird. Animal shows up again. Why? <coughs> Lumos. Nice. 
Is that level 7? Am I level 7? Action! One plus spider, which is eight, is nine, which means four, which means I need Tweety Bird. And then 13 plus three is 16, which is eight, so I need spider. So I need Tweety Bird and then spider. Tweety Bird and then spider. Tweety Bird and then spider. Here it is. I love how the game is very much trying to freak out with those statues, and I dig it. Sixteen. It's not eight I need. It's five. How silly of me. Medium decorated tables. Stylish informal school uniform. I thought I'm just running around the school. For no reason. Just to kind of... Learn a little bit more. Gain a little bit of power. Ooh. Nice. Like, on the one hand, I'm like, man, this rope's pretty badass, but it's hogging my style. I'm like, no, it's level two. I'm level six now. As soon as I get a better one, Rebellion. this puppy's out. Ravenclaw Tower, you say? Let me also. Revelio. Alright, I want to do that later. I am getting a bit ahead of myself. I wish to climb the tower ever higher. Raven called that. Rebellion. Is this the headmaster's room? No. Anytime I see that eagle, I always think Headmaster's room? Or Phoenix, or whatever it is. Back into the actual building I'm supposed to be. I love how I was just like, I'm seeing those things everywhere. I'm like, I'm going to have to start collecting them. And sure enough, Revelio. Yeah. Like, I'm going to have to go into most of these rooms for the storyline eventually. So the fact that I'm going to have been to the point where it's just like, no, I'm good. I don't need to explore. I've already been in this room. It's nice. We just... Because I haven't quite poked my head through here yet. Oh no, I've been in there. Revelio! We 
Where is it? Revelio. I feel like it's something I'm just missing. Is there a chest I'm missing? Rumor has it there's an abandoned man. It's probably that. I'd like to do something. I was like, there is that chest. Accio! Revelio! I'm gonna assume it's that chest. Until it's not. I might bump into it later. Nice. Wow. It really did just send me all the way around the castle. I feel like. Revelio. Maybe that shortcut it said was a shortcut was not a good move. That's a locked door. Whee! Peeves! Oh, oh, not again. Here I've come from the toilet bowl where she said I could swim. Did you practice a mole? As long as we're only one time per week, I can plunge the boy's lavatory. Not for the meek. Please, Peeves, you'll make me late. He tried to stop me, did rancorous carp, sought to trap me, confine me inside of a jar. But he failed, as did his containment charms, so I took my revenge to wreak havoc and harm. It was granted my privileges be handsome indeed, or I'd fire up the cannon, and so she agreed. To draw up a contract I love with peace. her, not with him, that if I behaved, I'd have one weekly swing. Rebellion. Uh, and it's wondered why nobody likes Peeves. Look at your head. I'm just a rather handsome man. Oop, there it is. Who have we here? Chan the Lanky says, Tall son of appears quite proud of himself for what percent. I was going to say, I'm like, he looks rather smug. What have we here? Revelio. Oh, cool. Is this the magic hallway? That's cool. I'm in the magic hallway. There's more to be discovered with this. Lumos. Akio. Levioso. Hmm. All right, let's go beat up some teenagers. Glad you can make it. Lucan's just over there. One. You guys know you could do this with the statues? Can you imagine this asshole showing up on his first day and just like solved so many mysteries? Yeah, it's pretty easy in here. I've also beaten everybody at everything so far. Alright, we'll see uh, your gear slots are free. You can decide on one of the gear in the gear menu. Protego! <sighs> what? Y you didn't tell me that I was gonna have to worry about inventory space oh, I didn't even get anything for that oh okay Rebellion. Well, in that case, I'm done doing stuff for a while. I'm sure I'll get taught something to do there. Can I help you? 
Sebastian told me to see you about a club. This if is... Sebastian vouches for you, that's all I need to know. I coordinated duels for crossed ones. A dueling club of sorts. It's invitation only, so you must have really impressed Sebastian. You're a child. I mean, I guess we're all here. I seem to have a knack for dueling. Then you've come to the right place. That's How not what you said I was work say. exactly? You show up, I match you with other duelists, and whoever is still standing in the end wins. Cool. It's cool, our cool, way cool. of determining the school's greatest duelist once and for all. And to liven things up, the winner is awarded a prize. Interested? Of course. Dueling's an entertaining pastime. I agree. Besides, in Crossed Ones, you could duel with a partner if you like. Your first time I'll pair you with Sebastian. Next time, you'll need to bring a partner along or duel alone. So, care to step into the ring? Perhaps later. Come back when you're feeling up to it, if ever. Fuck off, kid. No, what I wanted to do was because I figured. Ooh, excuse me. If they would give me an item, maybe two, and thus. Let me just destroy those two. And I really don't want to destroy anything else. I don't like destroying things in games. Hello, like Luca. Selling them. I wanted to talk to you about crossed wands. Ah, look who's back. Yes, so, yes, I'm ready to kill a child step into in the, the ring. ring. I'm ready. Get me in the ring. Spectacular. Let the fireworks begin. We'll make you regret signing up. Model? Breakthrough yes, is completely good. Target lock, caps lock, let's check them as well. Okay. Let me go. Did we get hit? Big hit that round. <sighs> nice work. Sebastian wasn't wrong about you. No. There's strong competition ahead, but keep this up and you could be the next school champion. Brilliant. Count me in. I shall. Now, it takes time to organize these duels, but <coughs> check yeah, with I me later. Yeah, I figured as much. I may have something lined up for you. It wasn't going to be like an you. arena thing where... Again, congratulations on your first Crossed Ones victory. Well thought. Like you did all of it at once kind of thing. Hope to see you back here again. Give me a prize? Or did I delete stuff for no reason? Another quick jaunt across the castle. Ooh. I feel sorry for your next opponent. Just wait till I've grown a bit, then we'll see how well you do. Oh, I didn't. I wasn't even fighting people my age. It's got to be something. I mean, obviously, it's something. Come on, let me pick locks. Revelio. Utterly. Oh. Beautiful.
defense against the Dark Arts Tower for like a second. I do want to see the library. Revelio. Damn, dude. Go. Got him. Revelio. There it is. Who the hell is this guy? Cedric Gregory the Smarmy. I love the naming scheme. The statue with an integrating medieval wizard Gregory the Smarmy, the wizard famous for Gregory's unctuous function. Potion makes you drink belief. I forget the potion is the best friend. Revelio. I just told myself I would stop doing this. Let me go to Hogsmeade and sell some stuff. I'm gonna do that. I wanna go into all of these places too. It's a relief to finally have an answer as to why that portrait was empty. What better way to learn, I say. That reminds me. It's I really have made a mess of things. Probably. Let me Is rub it in your face. Right? Oh, hello. Thank you for asking. I'm Cressida, by the way. And I'm afraid everything's not all right. I may be in a spot of trouble with the librarian. You see, I'm fond of creating my own charms. Thought I'd perfected my light as a feather charm to use on my library books. My arms get so tired carrying them around all day. But I must have confused the Latin word for feather with bird in my incantation, because when I opened my bag just now in the library, they literally took flight. Hmm. That sounds brilliant, actually. Thank you. Somehow I don't think the librarian will see it that way. I collect the books That's and remove the charm to... myself, except this isn't the first time one of my charms has threatened the peace of the library. Our meat told Madame Scribner they were my books flying around. So she said that if I caused her any more trouble, she'd write to my parents. Perhaps you could get All them the for books me. The first one there are only five. She won't be suspicious of a new student <coughs> looking around. Why did Army tell Madame Scribner that they were your books? Ah, oh, to be perfectly honest, I don't think he meant any harm. I think he was impressed, bragging on my behalf. Amit spends a lot of time gazing at the stars, but he knows a good charm when he sees one. I suppose I could help, if I have the time. Oh, I'd very much appreciate it. One of the books is my diary. I'd rather it not fall into the wrong hands. If you could collect them and bring them to me, I can remove the charm. Akio! right next to the library the whole time. Revelio. I'm going to have to use Akio to get those books. Akio. Got it. I need four more to go. She should not have told me one of them was her diary. Revelio. I'll come in here later and grab that. 
We've already established I got too much gear as it is. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. I'm most pleased. Accio. Section. Revelio. Accio. I'm hitting this fucking thing. Dual cardboard. This must be Cressida's diary. I'd want this back too if I were her. That's all I get out of that. Lame. Revelio. Didn't even have a name? Professor Weaver. Revelio. Ah. Accio. Ma'am. Revelio. Accio. Revelio. It's one of those. I'd seen something. How nice to see you, my young friend. Go where I think it is. is. Is that a robe item? It is indeed. Hmm. Yes. That's what I'm talking about. You look far more charming than you did a second ago. Things to do. I'm not impressed in the least. Revelio. Where is she? Oh, she went. Oh, did I not get all of the books? I guess one of them was pages. Accio. That's the last book. Now to take them back to Cressida. You owe me. Let me see those tatas. Teach me how to feel your emotions that you humans have. I can bear anything. Hello, Cressida. I collected oh, your shit, books, you including earlier? your diary. Oh, what a relief. Thank you. I'll happily take the heavy lot off your hands now. Unless you want your classmates to know how you really feel about them, you might reward me for my time. Oh, you're not at all who I thought you to be. And you're not who I thought you to be. Based upon your diary, you seem terribly judgmental. Fine. I shall pay you. But you cannot begin to imagine what I shall be writing about you next. 
Well, the next time you need me to... should never have trusted them. Evil lady. Not a good guy. I've collected a lot. Twenty three percent of those, it said. Revelio. I'll come back for you. Let me also. Give me. I'm becoming the most powerful wizard imaginable. And you gave me the tools. All I needed to do was collect the pages of a book. You can't imagine how inconvenient that is. And that's part of it. Yeah. What Also. about the room, Professor? I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. <laughs> ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Then why did you ask? Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit during your brief detour near... What was it you said? Some ruins? I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Have you and Professor Fig not discussed my training? He continues to be reticent about the details, mentioning only a few spells. Revelio, was it? And Lumos? That's correct, Professor. I see. I learned two and all that time. I'm trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that and regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged yeah. to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. You've managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own oh, wand so I'm gonna really to start be whooping far ass is what superior. Me. Can you tell me more about the potions shop, Professor? Jay Pippin's potions stocks a wide array of potions ingredients, although they rarely sell recipes. Hmm. Professor Sharp asks that they have a couple of particular recipes on hand for you. I oh, appreciate that. I've never heard of a spellcraft. A spellcraft is... I shall explain more about them when you... Okay. There's an Ollivander's in Hogsmeade. There is. Most people are familiar with the shop in Diagon Alley. We're fortunate to have someone like him nearby. 
Mr. Ollivander is a genuine craftsman and highly skilled wand maker. I would trust no one else to pair me with a wand. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. Sebastian. I'd like to go with Sebastian. Glad to hear it. Mr. Sallow is a capable young wizard. And he knows the area. He'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. I'll kill them all. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. My no time to waste. Day? The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. I love that I'm already going to Hogsmeade. It's day one. Revelio. Uh, excuse me. Can't. As much as I want to check all of these, I can't. Because my gear. I grabbed too much stuff. The soon to be reversed air of a second year. That's another thing from the movie. That's right, you're a peoples. I'm petting the kitty in the in the game just like I'm petting you in real life. You're a good kitty. Oh. I find the girls Ah, there you are. You have a new spell to teach me, Professor. Indeed I do, and an exceedingly useful one at that. The mending charm Repero. Fixes things right up, makes a broken object good as new in the blink of an eye. Hmm. It seems as if that might come in handy. More frequently than one would imagine. As Professor Weasley mentioned, I am not the only one who will be teaching so you spells outside of class in an effort me. to catch you up with your peers. A number of your professors have agreed to do so as well, but first, each shall ask that you complete a few preliminary tasks to hone your magic. Quest. I have arranged I some for today. See them through and then report back to me. <laughs> we will have you casting Rapero in no time. Why must I first complete tasks to learn Rapero? No lesson or lecture can compare to first-hand experience. And these tasks should provide you with just that. Such experience is invaluable when mastering... Okay. I'll start on the task right away, Professor. Revelio. Protego. Accio. Levioso. Oh, what am I doing? Collect the flying paper. This is the right area. Got it. Thank you. Baby, what are you doing? If you want to just sit on my lap, you can. A flying page must be around here somewhere. Revelio. Maybe. Might some kind soul help me? Are you all right? Don't you know who I am? Zenobia Noak, the girl whom everyone at school hates for no reason. Everyone hates you? Why? Because Hogwarts is full of bullies and spoil sports. Leander Pruitt's one of the worst, that no talent moon mind. I wanted to make some new friends, and so I brought my collection down to the common room. Collection? My gobstone collection, that is. I was hoping someone would want to play. Are you familiar with gobstones? 
Little balls, like marbles. Grand game. And if you lose, they spray you with a foul-smelling liquid. That doesn't sound fun. I haven't much interest in a game that sprays you with odours. Only if you lose, which I never do. Or at least, not often. <sighs> People can be so cruel. Just because they're sprayed all over with smelly gobstone spit, it's their own fault for losing. Imelda is one of the worst losers. Ever written a story or a terrible as well. And now those poor losers have taken my gobstones and hidden them in very high places all over the school. I will get this done for you. <sighs> Rather an overreaction on their part. Well, anyway, I can't... I don't think I know the necessary spells yet. I need... Do you have any suggestions on how to get your gobstones down from their hiding spots? If I knew that, I'd get them myself. Whoever hid you? my gobstones that high got up there somehow. Uh, Haven't you any sick? friends at school? Not really. Natty said hello once, but not a word since. I'll see what I can do. I'd appreciate the help. If you do find all of my gobstones, do come and see me again. I'll be back to playing Snake Pit and Jackstone by myself in no time. That sounds sad. Akio! Brilliant. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. I trust the preliminary tasks weren't too much. I completed the assignments, Professor. Teach Marvelous. Me you clearly know your way around basic charms. Let us give the old mending charm a try then, shall we? Remember to be deliberate in your enunciation and movements. I want to see some vigor. Now, wand at the ready. Yes, sir. Remember, your wand is a conduit of your magic. Nice. Repair room. Revelio. Ah. That's it. Very good. If you would like to practice mending something, have a go with that broken statue in the alcove by the water. It allegedly symbolized heartbreak. Perhaps a jilted lover thought it too accurate and lashed out. I'd better keep an eye on high places around the school for Zenobia's gobstones. Or... Or... Bodega! I could go to Hogsbane. Revelio! Open the gates! Rebellion. Ooh, bells. Such a beautiful flower.
Hmm. If those bouncing bulbs get big, they can be... Ghost. I've always said that travel broadens the mind. Well, Revelio. What is this? Broken broom. Lunar apparition charm. Ooh. Hot stiggity dog. I'm decked out to the nines. Let's do this thing. Hello, Sebastian. Ah, my new charge. I'm told you're in dire you. need of supplies, and I'm to accompany you into Hogsmeade for them. Is this your first foray into the village? It is. I haven't left the castle since I arrived. Well, Which I shall endeavor to be the night. very best of guides then. Hogsmeade's a charming little place. Self-contained too. What is going on in that section? We should be able to you. find you everything that you need. Shall we? We shall. All right, we're probably going to get into some combat. Repairer. Glad to join you today. As am I. Thank you, by the way. Of course. You're the only one who's ever bested me in a duel. The way I see it, I'd be wise to keep an eye on you. Rebellion. Let's run the whole way there, Sebastian. Yeah. Speaking of Weasley, <coughs> she seems to have taken quite a shine to you. level, huh? Ten? I'm almost there. I, I will be there soon. Nice there. I'm still surprised that a professor would entrust me with anything, given my detention. Revelio! Spend a lot of time in detention, do you? Just enough to keep me well-rounded. Beautiful water. Speaking of detention, this trip to Hogsmeade might have saved me from one. <laughs> Glad I could be of service. Madam Scribner, the librarian, was on the hunt for me, as is often the case. What did you steal from the Forbidden Professor section? Weasley came to retrieve me, and I was able to convince old Scribner that I had somewhere to be. So how did you manage to get on the librarian's bad side? Well, I suspect it's a matter of differing opinions. She thinks I shouldn't be allowed in the restricted there section. It is. And I, on the other hand, am inclined to disagree. Oh, just one moment. This is an excellent spot to gather lacewing flies. They're pretty to look at. Back here, chew them long enough, they make a powerful potion ingredient. Creepy statues. Merlin's beard from the Forbidden Forest. Look. What's going on? See for yourself. Quite a sight, isn't it? You certainly don't see that every day. Hippogriffs? Do you think Poppy's already seen the hippogriffs? 
Absolutely. Likely already named them too. To the left is the Forbidden Forest. Out of bounds to all students. Oh, hence but... the name. Precisely. They think it's too dangerous. I think they need to have more confidence in our defensive abilities. <laughs> ah, you can see Hogsmeade just past those ruins up ahead. Have you had much of a chance? Rebellion Castle. A little? It's positively enormous. It is that. I've been there five years and barely scratched the surface. Loads to see, places to discover. Oh? Any you'd like to share with the class? Perhaps one day. I can't go around telling you all my secrets now, can I? You still haven't told me how you became so good at dueling. <laughs> Let me open. Huh. Protego. All right. Uh. Sword. Yeah, there we go. I don't think that's how I was supposed to do it, but oh well. That's how I did. And that's all that matters. Walls at the ready. Akio. Revelio. I've always thought Thestrals pulling a carriage a bit grim. Though I suppose most people don't actually see them at all. But you can see them. Unfortunately. But you've seen quite a bit yourself firsthand too. <gasps> most notably that dragon attack. Hopefully the rest of your year isn't as eventful. Come on. Human transfiguration. Revelio. Cut stuck with fox ears. Mr. Moon. He's the Hogwarts caretaker. Looks a bit worse for wear. Hello, Mr. No Moon. Filch, huh? Have you met our new fifth year? Pleasure. Uh, you might want to turn back, Mr. Sallow. Uh, turn and run. Is everything all right, sir? Oh, it looked right at me. Eyes big as saucers. What did, Mr. Moon? Demi guys. Ugly and airy and terrifying. I shall be at the castle where it's safe. Good luck to both of you. I want, I, I want... A Demi guys. I don't know what he's putting in his pumpkin juice, and he's obviously had too much of it. I've never seen Mr. Moon in such a state. I, I don't know why, I just instinctively think it's a squib, even though Mr. Moon I keep you non-magical. My sister Anne thinks he's lovely, but I'd say he could improve a bit as a caretaker. Oh, is your sister in Slytherin too? She is, or rather, she was. She's not well at the moment, no but she'll be better allowed soon and back at home. Quality buddy with potion supplies. This is great. It's so full of life. I love it. For day one, this is great. Sure, it's a little broken, but we got patches coming. Revelio. Honestly, if one could bottle the magic of this place. I don't know if it's the shops or the people, but there's just something about Hogsmeade. We all flock to it like moths to a flame. <sighs> You're gonna make me follow you, aren't you?
go. There we go. Easy peasy. So how would you like to do this? Weasley told me you had a list of things to get. A wand and some other bits. Some other bits. Yes. Dittany seeds, some spell crafts, and some potion recipes. Perfect. Can't wait to see what you do with the new wand. And a short list gives you plenty of time to poke around the village. I just have to pop into a shop to find something for my sister. Let's meet up in the town circle when you're finished. Perfect. Remember, have fun. It's Hogsmeade. Damn. Revelio. Accio. Oh God, I if I lived in this town, Repairer. and just some kids in here Accio. doing magic, I would hate them. Ooh. I'm guessing the last one's the forest. Rebellion. First, they're teaching students jinxes. Next thing you know, it's unforgivable curses. Yeah, good. It's a wonderful thing to have in the village. Hogsmeade is very fortunate to have its own cauldron. Oh, there it is. An inquiring mind. Yes. I, my mind is here to inquire. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the spellcrafts Professor Weasley ordered. Matilda, student. I thought I might be seeing you soon. Can I also sell junk to you? I am the proprietor here. Thomas Brown. I take it you've had a conjuring lesson then. I'm afraid I haven't yet, sir. Ah, but you will soon enough. It is magic at its purest, creating something out of nothing. I don't think of you're Of course, it to is do not that. without complexity, but that is where my spellcrafts come in. Stay the course, Ooh, we, we, and you we, we, will soon impress even Professor Weasley. I think I will. That's certainly something to aspire to, Mr. Brown. I look forward to that day. And I, too, see in it. Spellcrafts are incredibly useful for conjuring unique items like custom pieces of furniture or decoration. But I shall let Professor Weasley do the teaching. A potting table and a... I believe so, sir. Good. Nothing like being able to grow your own ingredients and brew. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Oh, okay. Sell items. Should have destroyed that. Yeah, anything level two really can go. I'm purchasing it at cost zero? If you're interested, feel free to take a look around at the rest of my inventory. Um... That sounds useful. Tongue composer.
Why exactly? Can I not? I don't know why it won't let me sell that. I guess it's because I can also not use it. I... That has no properties. But it's basically wasted in an inventory slot. I don't want to sell these and find out that these are actually better. There we go. Ooh, that's nice, too. All right. Let's get to selling. Let's look at what we have, shall we? Level three. Who needs it? Get it out of here. It's junk. stared so blankly into my soul when I did that. Yo. Revelio. Let me see your magic. Oh, that's outside. Over here. Ah, the lock, of course. Revelio. Can I not? Oh, it's probably inside. So we gotta load new areas. Off on another adventure, are we? Yes. Almost always. It's kind of like it's my job. Obliterate would work on not obliterate. Well done. Oop. Lumos. Hello, chickies. That again. Tree nut. Stone wall. That's moving over there. Lumos. Promoted. Revelio. Give me. <coughs> Chocolate frogs. I want one. Levioso. 
Lumos. Akio. Lumos. Love this hedge, it's a dragon. Lumos. Okay, so I had heard that there was a lot in the world that wasn't like you couldn't. It might have just been the release, like the pre-release. But no, I'm finding a lot you can do. Akio, Levioso. Lumos. Lumos. I like this. <laughs> Nothing in here? Alright. Rebellion. Hmm. Ooh, money, 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 money. Akio. Get out of my way, bitch. Historically speaking, there's never been a Aw, oh, man. Rebellion. You guys must be bummed. Quidditch isn't allowed. Ha ha ha, losers. Here it is. Hello. Bingle and Batch. Don't just pick up tea and start drinking it. That's not good. You can't just, like, pick up somebody's tea that they left out. All right. Wooden gate. Rise. Wooden gate, double lamp. Lumos. Like, I think I, I I look at it, and then I go over there, and my perspective's different on it, and I immediately I'm just like, no, no clue. There it is. Lumos. It's like, you gonna come with me or what? Man, this one was close. Nice. Revelio. Now that I'm level 10, let's get that new level 10 gear. taste at this point and clearly that one's a little better cannot upgrade I'll have a better one by the time that becomes an issue yeah and I upgraded that anyways. <laughs> Fucking cool guy. Look at me. Revelio. 
key to give. Flutes and loots. Hello. No, all right. You know, Mora. The young today aren't willing to put in the work to learn magic. It's always the same complaints. Magic. Revelio. Big bag, big bag of money. Apparently. Ingus of Woodcroft. The Satures of Hope of Ingus of Woodcroft. The founder of the village. How you after everything driven from? Huh. Damn decent of him. What are you up to now? Revelio. Denoming the garden. Honey dukes. Magic spell, or at least a candy. So many things are just hidden behind locked doors. So. Oh, it's the money peoples. Revelio. It likes the golden coins. They explode when eaten. <laughs> Why would one eat them at all? God, I would just live for this. All right. If I thought that could be. That'll keep me. Akio! Our soldiers on the show down that path. Miss Peck from Rudy Peck said a customer lost a deer call around here. I know we're not supposed to go down there. I just thought... You could have got her in a lot of trouble. I'm very sorry, Father. Only she said I might earn a reward. Oh. Instead, I just wasted our time. There you are! Ha! Huh. Finally! I'll have enough for that wind whisk. Ah, well, not meant to be. Also, I may have knocked over a dustbin back there. Never mind, I'll fix it, as always. <laughs> Alright, where is this? Uh, of course. What about this? The, yeah, uh, of course. Not a very accessible neighborhood, this hog's made. Akio! I'm really burning through the required reading. Revelio. Akio. Revelio. Oh. Why, hello. This is worse gear. Oh. 
this is a place to like change how I look. Hello. Oh, come in, come in. Welcome to Madam Snelling's tra- I'm sure I've no need to introduce myself. But I showed them. They're stuck in the dust. But look at you. Look, uh, looking for a change, are we? Nope. I'm not sure what you mean, but I'm- Some are going for that muggle with consumption sort of death becomes me allure. But you won't find poisons here. No need for chloride of lime or ammonia when you have magic. Why don't you spend a moment choosing how you'd like to look? I should be going now. Yeah, I'm fine as I am. All of you are beautiful as you are. Revelio. There is no need to change yourself. God damn it, it's one of you. I was like, ah, another one. It's just like, nope. Can't go in there either. Broncos, tricks, and jokes. Give me some of your finest wares, traveler. I feel like this. I don't know if this is here. In the. Rebellion. Original. Or they're just doing this to be like, ah, uh, sorry. You can't go to Ron's place. Not Ron. George and. Larry. Harry? That's exciting. Oi, bruv. Akio. That's a go. Oh fuck, I'm almost level 11. I was like, is this shop foggy? <gasps> it's the three room six. Of course. Of course. Fuck me, right? find lying around. That's probably a good idea. Ah, oh, blind in my eyes! Merlin's blooming beard. Not again. It's me! I'll be right with. Ah, it's you. Um, just a moment, please. <laughs> ah, mm. hello, sir. I'm looking for for a new wand. Yes, it's about time. Yes, uh, about time. Well, you're our new fifth-year student, are you not? Oh, what am I saying? Of course you are. Gerbold Ollivander's the name. But of course, you'll have heard of the Ollivanders, I'm sure. Finest wand makers in the world. It's a pleasure to meet you, truly. 
Shaking ah, with the, come with me. I Let's find you the perfect second. one, shall we? Hmm. Uh, no, 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 not you. Um. Ah, yes, yes. Hmm. Powerful core, ten and a half inches. Hmm. You might do. Here, give this one a try. Well, go ahead, swish. Hmm, how odd. Uh, once more, come on, really swish it. Oh dear. So I'm going to say no. Well, this isn't a good match at all, is it? <laughs> uh, um, <coughs> we'll find you something, not to worry. Hmm. No, not you. Uh, Ah, hmm, perhaps, yes. A rare wood, 13 and 3 quarter inches, dragon like heart string. Do it. Let's give this one a try. Oh, I like that. Oh, 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 oh goodness. Oh, looks like it's back to the shelf for you. Uh, this is proving to be trickier than I had anticipated. How perplexing. Um, where are you? Perhaps you? Uh, ah, there you are. Accio. Yes, I think you might be the one. Here, take it. They're doing very well to make sure I can't see it. I get to make my own. I get to make my own wand. Curious indeed. How intriguing. Oh, okay. I wish the texture would get a little bit better. There we are. Curious indeed. I don't know if it's the notch I like. Curious indeed. I do like that. How intriguing. Curious indeed. How intriguing. Inches. Lucky Curious number. Curious indeed. Why? How intriguing. Is this one of these, like, it's not actually making it... Curious indeed. A difference, or is it one of those, like, I'm going through it too fast? Dragon Heartstring Wand is most powerful and learns quickly. Hmm. 
Hmm. A unicorn hair wand is most reliable and faithful to its owner. Hmm. Ah, phoenix feather. Exceptionally rare and a core with a strong sense of initiative. How intriguing. Not really. Curious indeed. I think I like that crooked How spiral. intriguing. Curious indeed. So crooked spiral, warm brown, black walnut, dragon heart string, stiff, 13 inch bond. What do you think? Another wand, another beginning of a bright and magical oh, I'm future. Kill so many people with this wand. <laughs> ah. Now, how did that feel? Good. Different. I sensed a sort of surge of some kind. A match. Your connection seemed particularly powerful. The right wand will learn from you, just as you learn from it. I'm eager to try it out. I would imagine so. A wand with a dragon heartstring core is capable of dazzling magic. Thank you. And the bond between you and your wand should only I'm grow sure stronger. It really won't Do not be much. surprised at your new wand's ability to perceive your intentions, particularly in a moment of need. That sounds wonderful, Mr. Ollivander. I'll let you get to it. Do come and see me again if ever I can be of further assistance. I'll kill you. Revelio. Um, well, now that I have, there it is, wand handles. Purely cosmetic. Rebellion. It's like I saw a book flying over there. What's the point of toiling if it can be done with magic? It's all you like. Akio. Give me. Thank you. Looking like you want to get petted, aren't you? Zonko's tricks and jokes. Ooh, butterbeer. Do you mind if I have one? This is the three broomsticks. Can't imagine how I'd have felt as a boy if my headmaster cancelled Quidditch. If 
something threatens me, first thing I cast is Protego. Protego! Like that? Did I do it? Are you proud of me, Pa? You can stop a thief in their practice. Come on. Rebellion. Now I realize what I saw over here. Or is it inside? Nope, here it is. Lumos. Come on, bruv. You can't climb up that? You climbed up everything else. Look like a dweeb, but I love them. Hello, Lumos. I see you. There it is. be having that. Revelio. Hogshead? That's the tavern, right? that oversees the city atmosphere and decide later. And it is salivating rather than loosely too. Making sure I can just sell this stuff. You can't I say that no spell should be illegal. I invented blue powder. The dude's name was Dark Wizard, so I'm gonna assume he ain't a good guy. Also, that I could have been using a map this entire time, but just refused to, because it's like, I want to Revelio. Or look at everything anyways. Man, I can't wait till I can start opening up locks. Welcome to J. Pippin's Pushins. Blue four eyes. Back. Check the four-eyed spectacles, because if they look... Ooh. 
Those do look stupid. Hello, potion man. Pardon me, sir. Oh, thank goodness. When I heard the bell, I thought you were Miss Lawang. Not that she deigns to come here. Though, I, I don't, know don't believe I've about. seen your face here before, either. It's my first time in Hogsmeade, actually. Is it really? <laughs> well, <laughs> Parry Pippin at your <laughs> service. And this is J. Pippin's Potions. Potions for all ailments. Well, where's the J when your name's uh, You'll Perry. have read it on the sign, of course, but Grandfather always made me say it in full. <laughs> How may I help you today? Professor Weasley sent me to collect some recipes. I'm new at Hogwarts. You're the student she sent the owl about. I set yes. your things aside immediately. I suspected if you're anything like I was at your age, you'd want your potion supplies. Is it not the most fascinating art, potion making? Right? Are potions really that versatile? They may not be as showy as spell work, but make no mistake, they are just as powerful. They can heal, destroy, protect, You'll discover all of this soon enough. Polly As it's your potion. first time in, I should mention that it's not just potion recipes I sell. I also offer ready-made drafts for all manner of uses. And I unveil new ones from time to time. Pop in when you can so you don't uh, miss out on anything. Hmm? But for now, let's get you those recipes, shall we? What can I do for you today? Well, give me the free ones. Ooh, Wigan World? Feel free to take a look at the rest of my inventory. Or come back another time if you're in a rush today. It's like I'm going to need all of this. And then, of course, let's sell our junk. Save the rest for the last. Revelio. Like, yeah, you know we gotta get that invisibility potion, y'all. Who doesn't want to be invisible? Akio. Revelio. Well, hello there. Oh, Mr. Neat. Pardon me, sir. I'm here for the seeds Professor Weasley arranged for me to collect. Ah, oh, the ditany for the new fifth year. Merlin's beard. Starting Hogwarts is a fifth Not at all. I'm choosing to see it all as one big adventure. Well, bravo. Not everyone has the temperament to take things as they come. Name's well, Timothy evil. Teasdale, by the way. And this is my shop, the Magic Neep. I keep the cart out here because I like a good chat. Can't very well be in the thick of things. <laughs> I suppose. In addition to seeds, I have plenty of plants. Grow everything myself. Okay. But what say we get you a pack? Let me guess. You're after something fresh. Give me the ditany. Do have a look around. Plenty of ingredients to pique your interest, I'd wager. Well, that's everything. Better go and find Sebastian. Always get the most expensive things first. I am... Not far away from that, actually. Revelio. If I open up like one or two, like probably just one more chest, I can get that last plant. 
back here. Got it. The Rebellion. fact that I've gotten most of these is fucking hilarious. Is this the giant eye one? <coughs> Let me just sort through your grave real fast. Let me welcome myself to the neighborhood. Plunder your riches. Rebellion. Oh, is this the Shrieking Shack? No. Alright, that'll be enough to get that last one. Don't mind me, madam. Whoop! Better gear? I gotta be level 12 to wear it. Jerk. Lumos. Smokestack. I'll be right back and then I'll plunder whatever wares you have later. Revelio. Don't mind if I do. Ooh, 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 ooh. Welcome back, small streamers connect. Happy to have y'all. How are you guys doing this evening? Lumos. Nice. Well, I'm doing that. Let me check up on these new scarves. Nice. With the exception of the dragon glasses. I'm liking it. I had a sheer wall. Perhaps it's this? Oh no, it's more of an over here kind of vibe. I have the feeling I'm going to be running by it. Yep, there it is. And it just joins me. Alright, so I'm going to assume I went the wrong direction. Lumos. done almost all of Hogsmeade? I've done almost all. I just started this game today. We're five hours into it, and I've gotten almost half of...
There we go. That hat. Have I not? Now, let me try. Still like that, but the hat though. I think that'll do good for now. Sort of like a mad wizard vibe. All right, I'm looking for a random smokestack. There it is. Akio! Lumos! There it is. As soon as I figure out what those things are... Hello, lady. Let's see what you have to sell. Oh, that one went smoothly. Nice. Give me. Hello. Oh, hello. Whew. Sorry I'm in a bit of a tizzy. I suppose it's my own fault for putting more than four to a tray. By the way, Beatrice Green is the name, but you may address me as Madam Green. Welcome okay. to Dogweed and Death Cap. Oh, uh, mind you, don't knock the mandrakes. Oh, if there wasn't the constant demand for antidotes, I wouldn't need to stock so many of the little deers. Except, of course, so for weird curses. That they look and, well, like babies. if you've been petrified, then obviously you've come to the right place. <laughs> it's gotta be so like knock screwy the mandrakes. With the oh, if there's an uprooting, you'll be the next one to drop dead, and God, I'm in no mood for like a clear up. Apply that sort of humanity to them, wouldn't you? Someone died here. Aye. Fortunate, really, that it was just the one. I think I'll just have a look around for now. Very well. What do you have for sale? Well, what say we show you some of what's available? I bought that guy's seeds, not knowing the better seeds would be over here. This is how the game gets you. Oh well, I'm pr I'm ridiculously over stocked, over leveled, over geared for the level that I'm currently at. So bygones be bygones be bygones. <gasps> Rebellion. Oh, this is be a book for me. Yes, 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 yes. One level twelve. What level did I need to be? Hell yeah. Tell you what. Akio. That owl is following me around, I'm pretty sure. Sorry, right. brood pack. Brood and pack. Alright. 
come over here. We'll buy the remainder of those seeds. Revelio. That way we don't have to worry. Ooh, big ass pumpkins. There, if I buy these from you. Let me guess. You're after something fresh. There we go. Now I can save my money to buy the good stuff inherently because I have all of the, the the boring stuff, the boom boom stuff. There's probably like an achievement or something for doing that throughout the whole town. Rebellion. lovely town. How do I unlock I all these locks and get into people's houses? Supplies. Excellent. Did you get what you needed for your sister? I did. So I suppose the world is our oyster now. Let's see what else we can get up to. <laughs> Kill some trolls. Um, that was a joke. I didn't mean it. What Draw it away from the building. Away from the building. Why are you here? Taste of his own medicine. Although it's like you didn't kill him, you still got a little smidgen afterwards. Um, hey kid, did you just Goodness, uh, completely a troll. obliterate? Did you two a take on a fully grown troll by yourselves? I suppose so. It's all a bit of a blur, to be honest. Merlin's beard. Are you all right? Yeah, we are. I mean, I'm we were hungry. glad to help. I'd say help is a bit of an understatement. Nerve like that. The makings of an aura, if you ask me. If you are unharmed, perhaps the two of you wouldn't mind helping me put a few things back to where they were. Of course, officer. Singer. Officer Singer. And thank you, again. Yeah, no problem. And this is why they repair get us repair out. Go see what he wants. Okay, for me to be so powerful that I can repair out that. One less thing for Officer Singer to worry about. Lucky they didn't do more damage. There we are. 
straight into the cell pit, boy. Hello, sir. I don't believe we've met. Allow me to introduce myself. Oh, you look Augustus eccentric. Hill, Clothier extraordinaire. I should like to thank you for your remarkable bravery in fighting those trolls, and not to mention Gosh. your help restoring Hogsmeade to its rightful state. I was happy to help. Frankly, you deserve an Order of Merlin. But I can offer you something much more useful. I own Gladrag's wizard wear, and among my inventory are some unique items that afford certain protections, as it were. Life-saving protections. Or magic. And as I you don't suspect have to this would be your it, last no, hide it dangerous encounter, I'd like to give you one such set of robes. In thanks for what you did today. Thank you, Mr. Hill. That's very generous of you. It's the least I can do. You're goddamn uh, right. Now, now let's try this on for size, shall we? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. You fucking cheapskate. I'd say we've earned a butterbeer or two, wouldn't you? Might help me forget that I was almost pulverized by a troll. Oh, I'm I'd brother, say that I agree you? with you. Perfect. The three broomsticks is just this way. I mean, can't we get one in Hogsmeade too? Ooh. Nice rebellion. Battle-worthy items. Should you be fun? I do. Welcome to peruse my shop at your leisure. Ooh. Assuming it isn't utter bedlam in there, we might even meet Sarah, the owner. She's a good one to know. It's a bag of money in there, and I want it. Plenty for your perusal today. Take well, your time. Let me sell everything that you gave me that straight up sucks. I hate that you're giving me school-based clothing. Oh, well, at least it, you know, shows off my Slytherin powers. My cool Slytherin nature. How are you, Void? Plenty for your perusal today. Take your time. Hell yeah. Get rid of that. Get rid of that. And I'm guessing all this stuff is just going to be ludicrously expensive. Yeah, 375 is the cheapest, so I don't have any money for that. Oh! Oh, that's just the, it's the same location. Rebellion. <laughs> Give me. Good lord. <laughs> I have Plenty enough for, for some of your today. stuff now. Take your time. High Society Fedora. Classy. Well, might as well win in Rome, right? All right, let's equip that. Go from nine to 27. 
sell value is the exact same too. And then I can sell that. And then have some money for some Plenty for your butter beer. today. Take your time. I love how that quest is indicative of the fact that I should probably be like level one or two. Let's just go. He's like, yeah, don't ever do that again. You said you could get to the child when they came to Hogsmeade. That all you needed was a distraction. I gave you a distraction. I just watched a student troll. take down your distraction. Who's this child? What are you not telling me? Oh, he's the conduit all to Asian you need magic to know and probably the chosen if you one cannot get to the child, then you have no value to me. <sighs> Let's go. Hey, I think it Did was they him. see us? I don't think so. What was that goblin doing with Victor Rookwood? Ranrock is working with Rookwood. The goblin from the Daily Prophet. I knew I'd seen him somewhere. Quickly, let's get inside the three <coughs> broomsticks. How about we just kill them? I just killed a troll. It's a treat to see you, Lord Gog. I shall let you know if I hear anything. Thank you, Serona. You be well. What is up with that voice? Hey, baby girl. Mm, you're so tiny and perfect. Now, what can I... Oh. There's a face I haven't seen before. <laughs> it's my first time here. Welcome. Butterbeer's on me. Heard about the attack. I shall be looking in on the other shopkeepers and residents shortly. Glad to see you two escaped injury. Thanks to this one. Single-handedly took down a troll. Is that right? Well done. Thanks for this. My pleasure. I will say... <sighs> trolls in Hogsmeade. That's never happened before. Something's not right. The only brutes we usually have to deal with are... <laughs> Our timeline. Was that Lodgok I saw leaving just now? <laughs> Your clientele's not what it used to be, Serona. Not to worry, Victor. Once the two of you leave, the caliber of my clientele will greatly improve. I wouldn't do that if I were you, Theophilus. Come now. No need for theatrics. I'm only here for this one anyway. My friend is enjoying a well-earned butterbeer. Only want a quick word. Perhaps you didn't hear me. I said, my friend is busy. One would think you all had enough bloodshed for one day. Come, the ominous. The three broomsticks isn't what it used to be. Let's take our galleons elsewhere. Can't drink butterbeer forever. I can, actually. I intend to. Seems you've made an unfortunate enemy. Watch your back. Rookwood and Harlow are worse than any troll you might encounter. Trolls? Ranrock and Rookwood? What are you not telling me? I'm pretty fucking cool, dude. I promise to tell you everything. But it's perhaps best I do that later. And on that note, I think we should head back to the castle. Well, this dude is for sure gonna attack us on the way back. So here's what I'm gonna suggest. We ah, oh, you're crawling back? It's like, I'm making my way up there. First manual save. Uh, it says four hours, but my stream says I've been streaming for five. I mean, I did screw 
and go back in time a little bit occasionally, but no, yeah, that's nothing. All right. It's been 22 seconds since your last save. That's such a great thing to show you before you leave. She's a good girl. She's a good girl. You're a good girl. You are, baby. Oh, yeah, you think so? All right, I love y'all. It's been fun. This has been fun. I love chatting with y'all. Let me know how you've been, you know, let me know how you've been chilling. Let me know things go. Charlotte, thank you for the follow. Joe, thank you for the likes. James, thanks for the like. Thank you for the raid. Small streamers connect. And Void, thanks for hanging out.